Oh my gosh. Hi. Good evening, everyone. How we doing? Obviously, Maria Hill is in the deck. Come on, let's be real. Uh, this is your early YouTube. Hit the like button reminder. If you're watching in the present or in the future, hit the like button on YouTube. Helps out. Pretty cool thing to do, just like in general. Overall. Disco Burn, what's up, Angel? Get out. You got I absolutely roasted you pre pre show. Hope you're doing okay with that with that burn. Derek, what's up? Carlitos, what's going on? Thanks for using the emotes. Love, love me the emote users. Robotic Ramen, mad that I'm not on time. It's okay, I was close. I was, I was relatively close. All right, so yesterday I said I was supposed to get a haircut today. One's in chat if you think I got a haircut. Two's in chat if you don't think that I got a haircut. Quite a bit of ones. I'd say it's about 50 50. Legacy, what's up? You got all of them cut? Yo. Very good point. Very good point. Get a haircut on stream? It sounds like a lot of work. Alright. Oh no! I don't even have my camera. I was gonna switch and then have it be a dramatic reveal. I didn't get a haircut. I didn't do it, chat. I was supposed to. But I didn't. I did, however. I got a flat tire recently and I had someone come out and repair it. So I got something done, to be fair. I'll we'll get a haircut tomorrow. And bet your dang bottom dollar on it. Do I have a Koya in the deck? Here's the deck. Here is the deck. It's just kind of like a good card style deck. We got the She Hulk wave thing going on. We have a Chavez. Got Arrow in there, a little white queen. A girl Shuri. Fun stuff. That's the fun stuff, man. Get that okay fade. Very zoomer. Binks, there's another Twitch channel called Binks. Is that you when you were younger and going through a goth face? No. She actually, um, she wasn't streaming for a really long time while I had started my stream. I considered reaching out to her and seeing if she would get rid of, uh, give me the name. Because I don't, I don't really want to be Binks plays. I would have much preferred to just be Binks. No Captain Marvel. Captain Marvel's not that good. I am all... Nah, maybe I can fit in Captain Marvel. It's not too bad with Shuri, right? Spider Woman's just better though. Maybe I go Captain Marvel instead of Shuri. I never use uh or instead of Spider Woman. I never really use Captain Marvel. Also who the quote references though. Yeah, but like I don't know. It's just kinda like a general thing, you know. Kind of like a like a normal general thing. Uh, I think the deck is pretty good though. Three twos, two threes, two fours, two fives, two sixes. Some pretty good consistency with the Shavas. We'll, we'll, we'll throw Captain Marvel in here. The Spider Woman. We'll, we'll throw Captain Marvel in there. 
No haircut. No, I messed up. I done goofed. You ever see a kick-ass ring be like, I want to use this card, but it's not that good? Yeah. Have. The best variant in the game, dude. No, I'm gonna need more in here. Needs more chibi? I think I have all the chibi. Like, I have three and a baby. Not too bad. Yeah, this is my favorite uh, variant in the whole game. I, I don't think... Uh, I don't even think it's close either. Right, let's get this ready to rock. Uh, we do have... Uh, oh, I need to make sure to... Double check with D-Money on the time. D-Money. Uh, I'm gonna play Spelunky 2 with D-Money. We're gonna bring back the D-Money, the D-Binksy Variety Hour. We got the D-Binksy Variety Hour coming back. Is the Angel Variant... <laughs> Is the Angel Variant more expensive though? I'm gonna guess it's a 12 hundo. Got 12 hundo written all over it. It's really nice. I never have to replace Maria Hill in these decks because this is my fourth deck in a row with Maria Hill. I just keep winning. It's really weird. It's really weird when you put such a good card in your deck that you just end up like continuing to win. Very interesting. Boom. Kind of crazy how that works out. You know what I mean, chat? if you just have a good card uh, you just put it in all your decks oh, i don't need sarah in this list we're doing the she hulk wave thing doesn't really make sense with sarah she is a woman though that's very good very good for you congrats uh, you are correct in that that it is a woman look at my queen PB arrow. Oh, plus I'll get my 50th booster, so we get another chance at a arrow split. We were cucked, dude. We have 49 boosters for, it and we we're gonna try for our first like really good split. I like the Chavez split too. Nice, nice Chavez split. Little gold, little blue, blue sparkle. Uh, let's check this out here. By the way, if you're watching on YouTube and you just got here, maybe I'd really appreciate if you'd hit the like button. It's a free way that you can help support the stream. I don't run any ads during the live streams at all. It makes it really nice and easy for you as a viewer to enjoy without having to sit through advertisements. So it's super, super appreciated if you hit that. And a Thanos Guardians deck, it's really fun. That sounds very fun. Sounds really cool. Got an Inked Arrow with Blue Kirby. Damn, dude. I mean, you could be happy for it, if that's what you're splitting. Yeah, I have quite a few Chavez's. Chavez is a good card, man. Fits into a lot of decks. We're gonna try this. We're gonna try this deck tomorrow. I don't know if you guys have seen this deck. It's really, it's a really funny idea. It's called Folact. I, I call it Folactus. I think that's a great name for it. I'm kind of proud of my name that I chose for it. But Folactus is essentially just a Sandman ramp deck. But instead of like the good early game cards, you just play Galactus early game cards and you make your opponent think that you're a Galactus deck. And then you just play regular, regular ramp. I'm really excited. It should be a ton of fun. You don't see me... I never play Galactus, no. I never play Galactus. 
Phylacta sounds like a medicine. Phylacta sounds like something you would call oat milk or almond milk. <laughs> that's, that's a really good point. Needs Wolverine to really sell it? Yeah, I thought about it. But I feel like the Yondu and the Cloak are enough. Because if you see, like, Cloak on two, you just think it's, uh... Phylacta should be removed? I uh, strongly disagree with you. I think the Galactus is just like the new thing for people to, ma to get mad about on Twitter. Predicting a first match W? Oh, I accidentally I accidentally picked full Lactus. So we'll, we'll we'll get a little preview of this. The Galactus mirror. No, it's a move deck. Now I'm gonna say like, oh no, I forgot that that's how Asteroid M works. I'm, I'm fricked. Wait, does this move this? Oh. I hope that this works. Might not. They have like, uh, ah, oh, it did work. Get wrecked. Suck it. <laughs> like, what the hell? Roar. Hmm. Pretty rude, honestly. Could potentially still win with like Vulture, like Craven Vulture, maybe. He's like Craven Vulture Iron Fist. Maybe he has some sauce. He's got a little sauce. Fun but bad strategy is Mantis Yandu Bounce. I've emptied my opponent's entire deck by turn four. Nice. I was actually the first person to get a turn three, uh, turn three mill. Iron Fist doesn't work. Yeah, well, yeah, it's just, I was just like, because the Vulture would be eight, the Craven would be four, and then the Iron Fist would be two. So it'd be like 14 total power. Oh, yeah, and Sandman. Sandman was on the field. That's a good point. All right, back to the real deck. What makes Maria so good? So Maria Hill is insanely good, in my opinion, because in almost every game, you end up floating one energy. So because you float one energy... Um... At some point, you can play the Maria Hill card that you get for quote unquote free. So therefore, it kind of acts like a 2-3 that also get, lets you play a free one drop. Because almost all games, you're going to be able to play it on a turn where you're going to float an energy anyway. So you're able to then fill it into that curve. So, so in most situations, it comes out as a, as a free one drop. I want to turn this off. Dude, it is so nice. It is so nice that I can just like pick out all the shitty people in chat right now and just start getting getting rid of them on my channel. It's actually so incredibly nice. I wonder if he's just planning on um, 
I was just planning on killmongering eventually. Alright. We do go Shuri still. Shuri into like arrow. They'd be in a pretty good spot. Really big cards. What's a good Zabu deck? Uh, there's tons. I think that the Dino Darkhawk deck is probably the best Zabu one. Deck is too... Yeah, people are just saying that it's a woke deck and uh, just being weirdos. Someone said, like, uh, the All Hose deck is going to be sick. It's just it's just people who, uh, like, don't leave their keyboard. It's, it's tough, man. Hard it there for some people. What if I just pass? I kind of don't want to pass though. I kind of want to just like arrow she hold both left. It's a little bit spooky if um, we run into a Sean because it can kind of clear us up. Chat win women. <laughs> so true. They think they're bad for some reason. Can we play this on PC? Yeah, there's a Steam version, and then I also play on uh, Blue Stacks. How does Shuri and London work? Uh, you only get one Shuri trigger now. It used to be you'd get two, but now you only get one Shuri trigger. Because you can't play it on both locations. Um, there's a decent chance we could get a Yandu coming down. Or a, um, sorry, a Shang-Chi coming down for the opponent. It's a little bit hard to fit into this deck. Maybe I just say screw it and just slam the, the 11 power. But I, I'd much rather put it here. Maybe I go like, like here, here. Hope that this lands middle. There's also an argument, I just go here, but then if they have a big enough card, then they just win. If we have a Skillmonger come down, I don't think there's, there's seven destroyed. And okay, we could have a death and something. Death would be 12, so we definitely need to add something here. I think we should just be I think we should just do this. As long as we can win left to a to a to a death. I mean it could be a Sean. Yeah, as long as we can beat the death, we're fine. Scarlet Witch should turn off left. I mean I guess so, but then how do we win middle? We were down by nine middle. Yeah, Death Sean could have been the case. I don't know, man. They have a lot of destruction cards in their deck to be able to fit a Sean as well. There's a chance, but. I don't think that we have to play around Null there, no. I think that Null is such a rare, uh, rarely played card in those decks, you don't have to worry about it too much. Mysterio played after best benefit from double Shuri. I, I don't know, man. That sounds too complicated. I'm pretty sure it would, though. Pretty sure it would. Fox. Stuff from NWI. What's NWI? I don't know what that is. They play a Bucky Barnes who have a really solid Polaris play. Just no matter what, this Polaris play is pretty darn strong. It's actually a pretty cool deck. It's not too bad. It, it kind of works. Uh, it's just like a, a fairly solid, it's like a fairly solid good cards deck. I mean, when I'm not drawing any cards, it's kind of bad. Polaris on Luke Cage could have went kind of kind of nutso in the, uh, the Isle of Silence, but what are you going to do? Eh? What do we discard from their hand, by the way? I discarded a rock.
Got their demon? Yo, Pog. Northwest Indiana? You're really close to me. I live in Chicago. I wonder if I just play out the Captain Marvel here. Maybe I just wave. And we know we get Chavez next turn. Like, there's a world where you just wave right and then arrow left, right? And it just works. I think it's going to work, chat. Wait, it's not going to work. Never mind. Um, But I do kind of have a 50-50 here, right? Oh, chat. They're going to play Carn... Oh, wait, it doesn't matter. I was going to say they're going to play Carnage right. And then I could arrow it away and then have them Carnage their own century. I don't think... Uh, because we're going second, that's not going to work. I don't think we have a win con here. Because the Carnage is going to be six. I could also Valkyrie, right? Valkyrie, right? I don't have any counter to. I guess they, I mean, they Valkyrie, right? I could Chavez, but them, them being able to win middle was good. We'll just run. There's just too many ways for me, for me to lose there. If, if we had kept, stayed ahead on certain uh, locations, we'd have been fine. Sentry was pretty big, though. No reason to go for that. No reason. Refill some missions. Hopefully get up to here. What's up, Ofasha? Welcome in. Yeah, we just gotta bail. Just gotta be smart. Hello from Kazakhstan. It's the ninth largest country in the world. How much money do you need in the U.S. to live an average life? It really depends on where you live. Hey, it's Vic Von Doom. They're juicy. Kind of weird. Really depends on where you live. Because there's like places like L.A. And then there's places like, you know, real, little rural whole dunk towns. So it's, uh, it's vastly different depending on where you're at. No Valka's tech? No, Valkyrie is not good in this deck at all. Valkyrie, I would, I would actually say, is uh, would be a horrible addition to this deck. You could rebuild a deck like this with that card, and it could be okay. But as is, it would be dreadfully. Deadpool? Peace! Nice try, you peace. Nice try. Alright, no matter what we play, it all gets funneled completely over to the left. Uh, we do have one more draw for a She-Hulk. It doesn't matter where we play this. It all ends up all the way over on the right. Yo, she Dazzle. GG's. I, didn't, I don't think I had any way to beat you. Did you have Carnage? If you didn't have Carnage or Valkyrie, she Dazzle, I think I could have beaten you. Potentially. But I just imagine you had either Valkyrie or Carnage and there's just no way of winning. There isn't really anywhere in America you can live comfortably in four or five hundred. Yeah, that's that's probably true. It's almost certainly true. I guess it depends on what you mean by live comfortably, though, right? Like some people living comfortably is uh, much different than others. Okay, death does nothing for us, but they also can't use their death. I think they'll do one more destroy trigger and we just wave and then we get to play their death. But I guess it wouldn't matter, right? Because then they would get to play their death. I think we just play the, the buffed Marvel here. Seems just really good. Four to five hundred a week. I'd say that's a lot more uh, reasonable amount. Okay. 
Okay. They can death in a one drop. They haven't played the hood, right? I and mean, we're plus seven. We should be fine. I don't know how they would beat me. Yeah, I think they're just they're just scooping. Be uh be my guess. Maybe they're not though. GG's. Zola? I think we're still fine even if they Zola. Maybe I should have played the death somewhere else then for Zola. Because then the Captain Marvel, Captain Marvel could have flown through. Maybe that was uh, correct to not. I, I actually, now that I'm thinking about it, I should never play the death on top of there. For, for Zola reasons. Excited for the draft Thursday? Hell yeah, dude. Bears about to be the best team in the league. You can quote me on that. The Bears don't finish the best record in the league. And you can come and make fun of me for saying it. You can cl clip this right now. And the Bears are going to have the best record in the league. From worst to best. Easy peasy. Four to five hundred a week is more than you would think. I mean, it's $26,000 a year. That's not... I, I don't think that's more than you would think. I think that uh, it's almost impossible most places in America to live comfortably on $26,000 a year. We already make fun of you about the bears? That's true. And based. I didn't get a haircut, Jalen. I'm sorry. You're gonna make fun of me now for liking the bears? It's okay. You can't hurt me more than uh, I'm already hurt uh, at all times being a Bears fan. I think we can just Shuri into like Wave, right? Might be the most power output we can get. I guess we could Scarlet Witch Maria Hill into Wave. It's a bit better. This isn't an insult, but I look like a Bears fan. Hell yeah, brother. Ooh, hope you didn't want your on reveal to trigger. Sure, it would be a shame if you wanted that on reveal to trigger. Comfortably is the subjective keyword there. Sure. Played two cards. There, I have a complaint. The opponent played two cards. Oh, it's a tie. Rare tie. Rare tie. Said you'd get a haircut yesterday. Well, I first of all, I, yesterday I did say I would get a haircut, but I said I would get it today. And instead, I fixed my tire. You have Bears jersey in the background? Yeah, we'll get a Bears jersey up uh, for the first few weeks for sure. We're supposed to have a bunch of like Uncle Sam America stuff, but uh, I'm just a lazy boy. I'm simply a lazy boy, chat. Bears gonna be decent this year. I think decent is, is the real real way that they will be. I think they'll probably end up like somewhere around seven and ten. Seven and ten, maybe eight and nine if we're lucky. Uh we got a lot better and we we have some good stuff. Binks is a liar, chat. You cannot trust him. He tells us he will get a haircut. What happens? No haircut? That is what happened, yeah. That is indeed what happened. I love Fields, yeah. I think the Fields is a uh, very impressive, very, very impressive player. 
Uh, let's just open up the field now. I was thinking about holding Scarlet Witch for later, but we'll just open up the field now. Uh, plus, this might be something he was trying to destroy. Uh, it sure was something he was trying to destroy. Very nice. Uh, we'll just get White Queen hanging out over on the right. Sandman we might have coming down here. Then we just go Captain Marvel, She-Hulk, we feel okay. Sorry, Temple Deck doing great for you. It's a good card, man. Okay, they they played Electro and a Wave, so that's uh, to me huge snap snappable turn. Victory. That's week my father and I got a photo with Urlacher still buzzing. Yeah, he's a he's a legend, man. He's a legend. I don't really agree with uh, a lot of the things he's said since he's left the league, but uh, as far as being a football player, he's kind of, kind of an absolute stud. Steelers and lost Big Ben, so he have not been doing well since he lost him, so he can't make fun of you. Yeah, but you had Mitch Trubisky last year. How was that? Pretty sweet. You like the Star and Stats deck? Yeah, I think the Star and Stats deck is really good. I, I feel like not enough people... Uh, appreciate how good just pure tempo decks are in Snap. I think that if you're good at playing tempo decks and just maintaining tempo and staying ahead, staying ahead, staying ahead, and then um, it be, like being quite smart at the very end about how you try and finish out the game, you, you can do a lot of really good things. Zeros didn't really do good with him till the end. I don't think they did good with him at the beginning, right? All right, sick Bucky Barnes. Opponent gets a blue Marvel, a little bit better than what we got. But, uh, you know, what are you gonna do, eh? Not a great start. We do have our wave and a She-Hulk. I'm a dick of some bozos now, ain't that the truth, man? Ain't that the dang truth? Okay, we cannot go. Hmm, I do not like this. Go Shuri into wave middle. Uh, I don't really like baseball that much now. I, uh, I'll probably go to a baseball game or two. But, um, I don't know. We'll see. You sure the Sauron list? Yeah. Uh, actually, just exclamation point YT. Uh, Tanner was up. Exclamation for YT, it's the most recent YouTube video. You can grab the list from there. Hopefully this is enough. They might just try and Sean me middle, which would be really nice. There's a non-zero chance they just slam a Sean middle. Thinking that they, they are going to get one over on me. Professor X is a very weird choice. Play on top of a Shuri lane. Maybe they thought I was going to do Carnage or something like that. I don't I don't really know what they were expecting. But we should be fine here. You don't sound like you're from Chicago. I haven't heard you say T. What does T mean? The highest rank? I think I'm at it right now. I'm at 110. Victory. Full power Captain Marvel. I think waving is better there. I think waving is just strictly better. Uh, we get to we get to finish out the game, and it proved to to at least finish out that game. I mean, there's a, there could have been an issue where they played a much bigger card middle, but I was kind of expecting them to Sean middle, um, to try and like call out whatever I was doubling. So if I had Captain Marvel there and they Sean, we would be in a really bad spot. Tree instead of three? Is that really? I don't even think that's really a Chicago thing. Hey, I got tree here. I got tree here. That almost sounds like a New Yorker. Yeah, wave is just, I mean, just wave into She Hulk something is just, it's so good right now. I can't believe it took so long for that to, I Well, I guess it was always played in death, but I, I can't believe it took so long for that to be played in, like, other decks. 
Kind of surprising. I kind of want to quadruple a Koye in my deck. I don't think it's good, but I, I just, I really want to do it. But we won't. We'll, we'll, we'll hold. For my thoughts on Cheap Keef, I don't, I don't like rap, so I don't really have an opinion on any rappers. I kind of, I just, I don't, it's just not my kind of music, so I, I, can, I don't really, I don't really have, uh, have, like, have opinions on, on things that I'm not knowledgeable about. We just Shuri here. I like Shuri and Bar Sinister is kind of nice, but. Now that Shuri's nurse, what's the new broken card that makes the game unplayable for Redditors? Everyone's been arguing about Galactus today, like crazy, dude. My whole timeline this morning, because I think it was like Nade Shot, who's the owner of 100 Thieves, uh, post some shit about Marvel Snap, and uh, he was just complaining hard as hell about uh, Galactus, and then a bunch of people were jumping in. What's my opinion on string theory? <laughs> I mean, I'm going to just say the exact same thing I, I just said. We are giving the opponent plus two, uh, if they play. I don't know why you would play your Spider Woman on top of my giant arrow. Do have priority? Do have priority. When all three lanes profit? It could do middle. New middle kind of cooks me. I had a thought process of like Scarlet Witching middle for that, but then I couldn't win Big House. If this is more than f four power, we're screwed. If this isn't more than four power, we're probably fine. On. Nice. Very close. We made it. Made it over the hump, man. What about string cheese theory? I, I miss a string cheese theory, dude. I miss. I miss a string cheese theory. There's also a string cheese incident. Who uh, plays at Electric Forest every year, and they're pretty sweet. When all three lanes profit, you know what's up. That's all you gotta do, man. Koye diff, Koye diff indeed. Do you put string cheese by peeling it, or do you bite it in chunks? You peel it, dude. What are you crazy? It tastes better that way. Arrow upgrade? Did we get the last booster? Let's go. Once you get to 500, then we'll uh, we'll we'll snag it. Oh wait, wait. Tactical lose one cube. Because hopefully we got a. Mi I, I want to make sure that we. I think we might have missed a mission. Oh no, we're we're gonna be fine. Okay, I was scared that we were gonna miss miss a mission. I just retreated for one. What here biting in the string cheese? I don't know, psychopath, man. Bet you eat corn on the cob the long way. What is that? How do you even eat it the long way? What does that even mean? Uh! Son of a bitch, dude. Look at this garbage location, chat. Oh, dude. Look at this freaking garbaggio, dude. Uh. That ground also looks really bad, huh? I was watching Regis play it a little bit uh, before my stream, or um, was it earlier? Was it like this morning? I don't remember when I was watching Regis play it. Uh. 
I don't even know what to do, man. I wanted to play. <laughs> I guess I just play. I just I just hope Captain Marvel's enough. Hope Captain Marvel Polaris is fine. I guess we could swap in Enchantress, right? Probably get Enchantress in here. Keep it a stack. Chibi Enchantress. You think she'll won Baby of the Year? There's... Personally, I think Mitro Patrick Porkins could have won by his own merit, but since the scandal with his father doing the Oro, obviously, unfortunately, deserved to be disqualified. Dude, I'm kind of a Bart Harley Bart Harley Jarvis main. I know that a lot of people hate on him, but I think that he shows some real spirit out there. And for someone to be that hated and to get to the final three, I think is uh, really commendable. But, I mean, you look at. Uh... You look at you look at Porkins and you see that button nose. It's just it's just really hard to say no, man. Really hard to say no. We have a million Super Skull Patriots. That's fine. We have Enchantress now. Clearly, we'll uh, we'll simply win. My name is Jeff. Okay, let's just start with Double Okoye. Seems pretty good. Then we'll go like Shuri Marvel. And figure it out from there. My name is Jeff. So you don't think this game will ever be a true competitive game? Sorry, you feel that way. Okay, unfortunately now we can't draw any cards the rest of the game. I have a chef! No, 16 power captain Marvel Pog. I actually get two 16 power captain Marvels, I believe. Uh, Helkin, I did make this in honor of Fell's Quantum Cup. I actually have an ad for it that'll play, uh... I'll play eventually. Hey, Mr. Jeff! Give me a big hit monkey. Let me actually make sure I download that right now. I mean, they could Sean left, uh, hit monkey middle would beat me. Damn.
Jeez. Wow, opponents being uh, a piece of garbage. Love to see it. Absolutely love to see it. Oh, the leader play is not what makes them a piece of garbage shit. It's responding with snap after you win. What I think of the upcoming spider season? I think that more move cards will be good. It's going to be a little bit scary, though. Move might get uh, super strong. But uh, we'll see. We'll see, we'll keep our fingers strong. We'll, we'll keep our fingers crossed. Oh man, they're going for left. That's actually a bit scary. Wait, we can turn this off with Snowguard, maybe? Ignore all locations abilities next turn. I could turn off Hala, right? That's actually pretty good. I could also change it. I could change this. Actually, I actually kind of like this with Captain Marvel. First time ever playing Snow Guard, by the way. I don't want that wave, but, uh, you know, this is what it is. Whoa. Never seen that before. That's kind of funky looking. Accidentally hit snap after a win meanwhile for fist bump. Felt so bad. Oh, was that you on the last game? <laughs> are you are you just saying that that you you've done that in the past? If that was you the last game and you meant to uh, you meant to hit snap, you're all good, my dude. I did call you a piece of gar. Oh, okay. I was gonna say I did call you a piece of garbage on stream, but uh, you kind of deserved it to be fair. Nice. With priority, if they're trying to blow all this stuff up, the Polaris is going to kind of kind of hit pretty hard. Hopefully, you get the Bucky. Be the the best thing to grab. Snap too. No guard win percentage going to double with this game. Look at him go, dude. What a beautiful card. Negative two power is going to be just enough. And then we just shop his profit, right? Maybe shop his mid. And then if they don't do too much left, the marble can jump over. Uh, I think for Felicity's uh, event, they, they banned all... Like animals, like it's just like human females or uh, humanoid females, human and humanoid females, I believe. Uh, I don't think he knows how this card works. I don't think this card works how he wanted it to. GG's. If my opponent is also running all females, you can run Morph. But Morph is a, Morph is a male, right? All right, we get to, we get to do a arrow split. We get to do we get to do a, a a chibi arrow split. We've been looking for the nuts chibi arrow. We've got a few okay ones. We've kind of missed just our, our really really banger one. We got this one. It's got the green, the green flare. What is this one called? Green glimmer flare. It's okay. Like the, the inked is pretty nice. I kind of want this one with gold background, blue Kirby crackle. That would be the ideal. 
Uh, other things we could do would be gold with gold Kirby Crackle. Um, inked with black, white, blue Kirby Crackle. All good stuff. Lots of good things we can get here. I thought Wright was locked like Professor X. But even if that was the case, he would have lost uh, left. He would have still lost, right? All right, big money. Rip red flare. Ugh. And red flare. What is this one called? Red glimmer flare. Ish. I kind of like crack. I kind of like Kirby crackle the most. Kirby crackle make, makes like pops just just a little harder. Six hundred. Yo, Pogarino. Um, anything else I'm working on? That was most of my credits, wasn't it? Still got a decent bit. We'll finish, uh, finish these. Or we'll, we'll try and finish these best we can. But you got the red flame on the flame background? What? So DC throwing the hat in the ring with a card game? Yeah, they they announced it like a few years ago, I think. But uh, it's supposed to be coming out really soon. God, terrible location. The next cards you'd spend tokens on? I kind of want to buy like three next month. Next month, I kind of want Howard the Duck. I want Iron Lad and I want High Evolutionary. So I might I might splurge next month and get three of them. They all look really good, man. Saren a series four or three. I believe it's a series four. Well, it seems very good at the video game. They're playing a Patriot deck during the sandbar. What does Snowguard triggered the effect of this location? Uh, triggering it wouldn't do anything. There's a, a lot of things that don't really work with triggering. Um, hopefully, do we, we kind of need to like top deck um, She Hulk here. Someone really wants to win the sandbar. Hopefully we can hit him with a nice little surprise Captain Marvel. They also full skipped. I'm hoping they move one of these over. Thinking that there's no way that I beat them here. For this second, right? And then the Captain Marvel swoops in and, and wins. That's my hope here. Like they move like the Cyclops and the thing or something to try and go hard for New York. And then the Captain Marvel sneaks around back. Oh! Uh-oh, where are you going, buddy? Let's go. He clearly didn't want to win the sandbar enough. I don't, uh, I don't, <laughs> I'm very surprised that they, I don't know why they full passed on turn five. Was there, is there like, <laughs> I wonder if they're making a joke and trying to just play the vanilla cards. GG's though. I don't know if I would support how the opponent played that, but uh, you know, what are you, what are you going to do? Yeah, it's a high evolutionary deck, so true. Punch trying to win Sandbar. They were so close, man. Snowguard's powers for both players, not just yours. What's wrong with that? Kind of kind of expected. Uh I kinda of like to play on curves, so let's get rid of super flow. The Sauron deck might be good today? Yeah. Okay though. 
We're we're content. We're 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 less of a Marvel Snap player and more of a Marvel Snap content creator. You know what I mean? If I was just trying to play to win as many games as possible, I would do that. We're just out here trying to trying to get some content, man. Throwing priority. <laughs> Why would they want to throw priority to play an abomination? But does it get Sean? I guess. I don't. I just. I don't understand. Uh, we should be in a good spot to pass into Arrow She Hulk. Should uh, should help us win quite a few games. They're really banking on uh, Strange Academy here. I can't. I don't even want to do the wave thing. I don't even want to do the wave thing because uh, I can't play the She-Hulk. Yes, Aka Jones? Well, they're basically saying they're not going to play middle, right? If we just go here, here... Oh, wait, I can't play right. This is the damn sandbar. Yeah, they can't beat 17 power middle. Captain Marvel? No! The, one of the, the only card they can play that beats us, you piece. You absolute piece of work. Who plays Captain Marvel in their deck, dude? Uh, no, yeah, Payback. Uh, I wasn't trying to be uh, dismissive of what you said. I think that uh, playing Sauron deck is very smart right now and kind of interesting uh, compared to the normal Patriot builds. Also, a lot of Patriot builds will be playing Super Scroll uh, to counter other people playing Patriot decks, and your deck is a hard counter to Super Scroll because you run a lot of bad ongoing effects. Uh, so I definitely... Uh, <laughs> yeah, Inky, you get it. <laughs> I definitely think that that's a smart idea, dude. I am so mad that this that they printed this location. It's actually one of the worst locations. This might be. This is a bottom five location for sure. What what the, we talked about this when I did my location tier list. One of the things that pisses me off the most, um, is just when things like. I think the Polaris is pretty good, and then we can, plunk around on turn four. Um, like, locations that randomly just benefit certain spots for, for no freaking reason are just so annoying. Like, perfect case in point would just be, like, the sandbar, you know? I mean, we have arrow in the deck, so... Um... I guess the problem is that if they Doc Ock right, we're in a bit of trouble. Because then we don't have anywhere to arrow. Yeah. Freaking sandbar, man. Terrible, terrible location. Horrible location. Why not Missy La? I mean, it doesn't matter. They're Galactus, right? Doesn't matter if I have a Missy Nath that I can play their shit. It's a Galactus deck. The problem was that there was a sandbar that I couldn't play the arrow there. Tough, man. I guess it wouldn't have mattered because they also didn't have a card there. But if I had arrowed and then they Galactus, they couldn't play anything on the last turn, right? I guess... No, yeah, they couldn't play anything on the last turn.
Yeah, it was a pretty big knoll. It was like, what, 40 almost? 35, 30, 37. Oh, actually, I do not want to Okoye. Okoye is actively bad for me. You'll probably just wait for location to go. Was that death I just hit? Wait, why did my opponent play Electro right? That game. You guys notice that? Because I played the Polaris right and then they had a ninja middle. Victory. They had a ninja middle and they played Electro right around my Polaris right? That's really weird, dude. Favorite card is Maria Hill. She's one of my favorite cards. I definitely think she's the most underrated card in the game. Isn't Yandu bad because you killed the death you could have pulled? Uh, but it also could have killed any other card, you know? Yandu is not a disruption tool. Uh, you have to like learn the the basics of you have to learn the basics of okay. I'm just gonna start retreating whenever this location shows up um, You have to understand the fundamentals of card games to know why like destroying your opponent's top card in their deck isn't actually a benefit for you it's a benefit in decks like Galactus or any deck that runs Null because it counts for your Null. It's good in like things like Death Wave because it triggers your death. Outside of those two decks, Yandu is never a good card. It is just a 1-2. Isn't it 50% of games? Yeah, I'll just retreat 50% of games. It doesn't matter. We're an infinite. I finally get to say I don't care I'm an infinite, okay? Let me have this. I don't think it's an okay hot location. I think that it is a awful location to add to the game. I think that I think that conditional locations where you can't play into unless you have a certain type of card are horrific for the game. It just gives one player almost always just a absolutely absurd um just like an absolutely absurd like better chance. Yeah, we got an Iceman on Maria Hill, by the way. So Here's a classic example. So many people come talk to me about like, why is Maria Hill good? Why is Maria Hill good? Why is, why is Maria Hill good? This is why Maria Hill is good. Just as straightforward as possible. Maria Hill gave me a one drop that I can play on turn three because all I had to play is a two drop because I have Wave and She-Hulk. Gives you options and it gives you low cost options, which are a super high premium in this game. So basically what Maria Hill did, if I did not play Maria Hill and let's just say I played just like a okay two, three, let's like a Colossus, I don't know, whatever. Then this turn, I would just be playing Scarlet Witch. Instead, I get to play an Iceman and a Scarlet Witch. It's insane, dude. It's insanely good. Digital locations suck ass. Victory. Oh yeah, yeah. Maria Hill gave me an extra Hulk. Maria Hill was a two energy 15 power card. And you guys are laughing? It's a two, hour, two energy 15 power card and you're freaking laughing? Get on my level, dude. A two, okay, not only a 2 energy 15 power card that made the cost of one of my opponent's cards go up by one. Okay. Is the new location that much worse than Sanctum? Yes. Sanctum is a dual effect. Both me and my opponent cannot play into Sanctum. 
the sandbar says if you are playing Patriot, you can use this location. If you are not using Patriot, you cannot use this location. That is stupid. And, and I also think Sanctum's kind of bad, but uh, Sanctum is like okay for the game, as long as it's rare enough. No, Debris is terrible because everyone's just going to be playing Patriot. Like 40% of people that you're playing are going to play Patriot right now. Or they or within the next hour, that, that's what everyone will switch to. It's the perfect example of a of a location that is both bad for the game when it shows up randomly and bad as a hot location. There's not many examples of that. But this is one of the examples. That's that's bad in both instances. Super Skull and Rogue, it does, it, I mean, you still need, you're still going to lose Plunder Castle. Like, I put a Chantress in to kind of get around it, but it's still going to kind of suck. I mean, you didn't do the Maria Hill combo this game? Because I'm playing a Koye. I'm adding, look at how strong my Shuri is, you piece. Okay, this can't be Galactus, right? Because if they Galactus Mindscape, they give me their good cards. Should I still play around it as if it's Galactus, though? Museum hits a sour spot for me uh, because it, it is the hot location of the day I bought best. Meter? Okay. Uh, we're pretty far behind, unfortunately. We want to keep our hand? Kind of. The problem is that they're going to try an Odin left at the end of the game. So I have to like be able to beat that, I guess. I guess the Captain Marvel kind of is just like fine, though, right? Because they're they always play Odin at the end of the game. They always play Odin at the end of the game. It's just not they're they're it's impossible for them not to play Odin at the end of the game. I don't even care about Chavez. They just play Maria Hill. The opponent always plays Odin left. There, There is zero world where the opponent doesn't play Odin left, chat. They always play Odin left to try and get leader and arrow. It's just that there's... Uh, I, I refuse to believe in a world where they don't play Odin left here. I refuse to live in that world. It just, there, there's... The opponent, they're, they're salivating right now. They're salivating with the, the, the chance to possibly play Odin left. They're absolute, they're, they're, they're smacking their lips. If you would. Where's Chavez? I had a full hand. Purposefully. What a piece. I was wrong, chat. I'm very, I'm not very often wrong. Nice dance. Nice dance, Captain Marvel. How's their arrow 10? Magic World where you actually drew the cards you need. Yeah, no, man. It's a tough world out there. Like the longer Binks monologues about why if I want to play X, the more likely it is to happen. Dude, it's just, uh, it's like the, um, the laws of attraction or something. I don't know exactly what it is. <laughs> It's like a uh, it's quote unquote law of the universe that uh, you can think something into uh, existence, right? Could be a sniper. Eh, it could be. It didn't seem like a sniper to me though. I'm gonna guess they just didn't draw Odin because I think if you have Odin in hand, look, I'm the Patriot deck now. Look at me. Look at me. I am the Patriot deck now. We're infinite, we don't care if we lose. Doesn't mean I'm not gonna try to win, you know? There's a difference. 
There's, there's a difference, chat. Mm -hmm. Let me do this turn. We just YOLO Cosmo. Let's do it. Let's see if we hit him, snag him. Did we snag a card? Not really. They could now put their uh They could now put their Patriot behind that, which is a bit scary. Uh, but we can deal with that as it happens. Scarlet Witch, freak them out. I don't know what's going on. Keep on their dang toes, chat. Monster Island onto a Patriot deck. Absolutely love to see it. And with the Enchantress. Hopefully they play another uh, another ongoing card, right? This is the first time I've played Enchantress in a really long time. A long time. Steak dodges the Enchantress. Only we had priority there. I could have stopped the Mystique. We're actually tied. Uh, we do get dumpster pretty hard by Ultron here though, right? Ultron will add 9 left. 9 right. 8 middle. Kind of a lot of power. It's no joke. We we'll probably just have to run here. Draw RNG is why you can't play Moon Girl in Death Wave. I can't play 12 games and never get premium hand, yet my opponents will. Uh, it's probably because you have a biased take that you care more about when your hands are bad than good. Uh, I would say that you and your opponent probably get good hands at the same rate most of the time. Can't feel that way though. Human nature. Or it's just rigged matchmaking and your opponents get better luck than you. You know, whichever one you want to believe. I'm running the Dark Dino deck today. I got hit by Enchantress. You were shook. You should be able to win uh, getting hit with an Enchantress in that deck. The deck is meant to... Uh, that deck is meant to to win those games. Yo, opponent, give me a rock for the sandbar. Absolute fool. An absolute, an absolute buffoon. Do they not know how much trouble they're in? Honestly, not too bad of a, not too bad of a trade. Yeah, you know, we can go Shuri. I think we go Shuri Arrow here. I guess we get into some trouble with Hogter Doom, huh? Please be the second card. Ah, I was not. Ah, oh, we're screwed. Are we though? No, we're fine. We just kept the Marvel. They played Doom. Thinking that Doom is going to be enough. And then the Captain Marvel wins. And we have a rock. Oh. We have an Akoyade rock, chat. It's an absolute dead ringer. No! Victory. The hero we needed was finally here. My opponent gave me a one power rock. And they ran. I was actually maybe just going to do this and then uh, maybe not play around. Doctor Doom? Man, they're gonna play Darkhawk Mystique on turn five. That is a that is a ridiculous play. Moon Girl and the Darkhawk Mystique both on the right side of their hand. That is crazy, man. Lionel Lin! With the tip, says my Monkey Sara deck loves Sandbar. I'm glad that you're enjoying the Sandbar. Glad that you're, you're getting some joy out of it. Oh wow, Maria Hill in the deck, I'm stunned, so true. 
Noted Maria Hill hater Binks running Maria Hill in their deck. Let's get Shuri up to uh, legendary. <laughs> Playing Hero Wars tonight? Exclamation point Hero Wars. Shuri do be looking good at legendary. When you see Banks, you think of Marie Hill, dude. I'm down for that. Colby Smolders, dude. Colby Smolders is my gal. Colby Smolders is a freaking queen, bro. Banks will die on this Maria Hill. Unbelievably true. And Egon with the tip. Thank you. Thank you. I need some people to tip with the stickers, though. No, sorry. I, I, I don't mean to say things like that. But I do think it's very funny when I get tipped with the stickers. And uh, <laughs> it explains what the sticker is to me. And and how fun. I, mean, I just, I think back to that a lot. I actually, I do think back to that quite a bit. How uh, absolutely ridiculous it was. I think we play Maria Hill here so we can play a Koya in a one drop. Maria Hill summon Rock, Raptor, or maybe Ninja. Nah, cannot. Just a one drop that you can add to your deck. Uh, just one of those. Fast is pretty, pretty bad here. Dies of Leech, lives of Bast. Am I right? <laughs> Thank you, B. I'm, I'm sorry. I shouldn't have said that. I do really appreciate it, though. But Bilu gives the, <laughs> gives the three USD that says pair character punching the air with fist and bump written on his knuckles. I'll show these to you guys too because they're so funny. If you're in YouTube chat, you can see what the sticker looks like, but I'll show you what I see on my end. It's so funny, dude. I'll show you what it looks like for me. Pair character punching the air with fist and bump written on his knuckles. Then we have... <laughs> what does that actually look like? I'm gonna guess it's pretty well described, right? Ah! A salt shaker. What was I saying? I don't know, man. I start saying a lot of things. Dude, that is a very good explanation of him. It is a pair character punching the air with fist bump, his <laughs> fist and bump written on his knuckles. So incredibly true. And Inky's is, is literally, it's just a salt shaker. Yo! Oh my gosh, I missed, I missed who that was. Oh, it's Mark in the Clouds. Mark in the Clouds, tip 20 bucks. Thank you so much, my dude. Unbelievably generous of you. Helping financially support the stream. Thank you, thank you. What do we do here? Do we pass? You need a destroyer? If we, they destroy it, we force it left. And then we play shot this right, then we win. This depends on how big this is. Oh no. We're gonna lose. I don't know why, I always think that it's going to be a destroyer, and I feel like it, it, it often is not. I mess it up. Only I could play middle. I think that this Nimrod deck makes a lot of sense to play right now, too. Thank you so much, Mark in the Cloud, by the way. Or is it Marcin the Cloud? Like, it's a cloud named Mark Marcin. I never know. I never know if it's Mark who's in a cloud or a cloud who's named Marcin. I think it's just kind of like, 
somewhere in the somewhere in the middle. Watch for Britain decide to finally say hello. Yo, what's up, Brunkus? Shout out to, to the YouTube employee who had to write those descriptions. Yeah, it must be the um, it must be the uh, alt text for them. It's Mark in the cloud, but Marcin the cloud is fancy, so I don't mind it. Yeah, I was pretty sure it was Mark in the cloud, but, but the first thing that I always see is Marcin the cloud. Like Marcel the Shell. I should watch Marcel the Shell. Apparently that's like a really good movie. <laughs> Whatever, we have Shuri Marvel. I just I really just want to start skipping every every time we have to play on the same bar. Now this is interesting. I, do you think you can zero? Do you think you can zero a card? I bet you can't. Yeah, I, I wouldn't think that you could. Oh, he played Ebony Maw. Incredibly clutch. Hood not very. Oh, the hood's cracked! By the way, Maria Hill Doubters. Hmm. How do I do this though? Just give right. I'll give mid. Okay, I almost just immediately retreated. But I think we're okay. I think we're we're more okay than you would think. Piece of shit. We're less okay than you would think. They can do mid last turn, but we can demon left. We can we can demon left. Demon left beats win sandbar. We could have demon left. Arrow right, but arrow right kind of has its own problems. I don't know. Why is vision in their deck? People think it's a good card, maybe just for the hot location. This location sucks ass. It does does indeed suck ass. By the way, Maria Hill Doubters, I fucking hate everything right now, dude. This is the like the third time I've said something about Maria Hill Doubters because I got something crazy, and then it just fucks everything up, dude. What are they going to do, though? Double vision, you piece. Double vision? It's a garbage. Real haters justified? No, the fucking got a rare location that ruins everything. This piece of garbage really played leech, huh? If 
I get my Oh wait, I could play in sandbar. That didn't matter. All they needed was something that was uh ten or more power we lost. Leech is actually really bad right now. I don't know why you'd be running Leech. Why don't you Scarlet Witch the bar? I don't know, man. I'm just I'm just trying my best, you know? Well, don't nux me after uh, playing Iceman Sinister London, you, you weirdo. Think you could have actually won that game? Yeah, I could have played it better for, for certain. Yeah, this could actually help them, which I don't really want. There's a 50-50 to pull the lizard from Murder World. That's yeah, fine. We take that 50-50, actually. I think two, two, three fives is good enough. Of course, his lens, uh... Very nice. Bonk. A little enchantress value. Could I actually won that game by not retreat? I don't think so. All I needed was a 10 plus power card after I wasted my Scarlet Witch. As long as they had a card that was more than 10 power, which it seemed like they probably did. Uh, we were losing left, and then we can't win right. Um... Not too shabby. Go with the nine power here, I think. The nine power is hard to say no to. Yeah, very nice. Very nice. Just just overwhelm them with cards and power. One of the least fun feature locations I think they've done? I would agree. I think uh Sandbar is the same thing as Plunder Castle for me. It's the bottom three location. Rough. All right, Shuri into double marble. I don't know. We won the game, dude. What, what do you want me to do? What do you want me to do? I'm sorry that I didn't win the game that you wanted me to. Okay. At least it's not Sanctum. It is worse than Sanctum. It is a worse location than Sanctum, I by a lot, in my opinion. Because it, it can just completely destroy you unless you're running a specific deck, and that's stupid. I much, much prefer Sanctum. Look at that, and we get Misty Knight. Oh. Not that we need it, but it is kind of neat, right? Hill value again, so true. Just think out loud, what would make a fun location? Fun locations are locations that uh, encourage intelligent play. So basically they reward players for playing around it properly. Uh, they add a wrinkle to the game that's uh, like enjoyable or, or interesting or unique. Um, and uh, I think that they add value to, to every game that's played. I can give you some examples, actually. Uh, do I want to get rid of this? I want to just do like this. Just see how they how they deal with it. Krakow is also very annoying, yeah. Krakow is really bad, too. Chantress on 5 will be awesome. Oh. Chantress now. We'll just go for like uh, Captain Marvel Agent 13, see what happens. One that more is three and four cost is cool? Yeah, it's pretty cool. Go is completely random AI. Let me see if I can pull up. Um... 
my my tier list here. Mogwai did bully me about this on Twitter. It was very rude of him. But uh, for instance, I think, um, here, I'll, I'll finish out this game and then I'll show you. Mogwai did bully, bully me about this on Twitter. It made me sad, it made me cry just a little bit. We don't really know how we're winning here. But we're going to try. Damn, dude. Arrow diff. I actually wonder if that had pulled, like if I had played those in the other order. I guess it still would have buffed the Agent 13, but we would have won right anyway. That was a very risky play by our opponent. Uh, anyway, here's here's what I think is the tier list. So I think that... Um, Alright, it's kind of hard to see. Sinister London is S tier. I think Sinister London adds a lot to the game. It's very interesting and unique. Uh, I think that Daily Bugle is probably the most elegantly designed location in the entire game. Uh, Daily Bugle, it's just like it gives you information. It gives you just a card. It's very simple. Adds a wrinkle to the game. I think the Daily Bugle is like the perfect location. Uh, Ego I have up here just because it's a super rare location. Uh, obviously, if Ego was very common, I don't think Ego would be fun at all. But because it's very rare, it's kind of like the uh, rule one of, of Marvel Snap at School. Bar Sinister is a very interesting location. There's a lot of work around and a lot of ways that you have to decide. Do we play in it early? Do you play a tech card on it early and give it up? I think the Bar Sinister is awesome. Elysium, who doesn't love playing cards cheaper? Uh, Project Pegasus, just the plus, plus five energy. Do you dump your whole hand? Do you try and be tactical about it? Really weird turns. Nexus, a really weird kind of like push and pull with it. And then there's lots of weird tricks that you can do with things like Scarlet Witch as well as uh, Storm on it. Uh, so those are like my S tier locations. Those are like the, the super, super sick ones. Uh, yeah, everyone's going to disagree with, with what I have uh, in many ways, and that's okay. Uh, but I, but the, the, I'm just giving you my opinions on it. Real chance watch the full tier. This video is really long. Uh, so like World Ship, again, uh, if it was super rare, it's, or if it wasn't super rare, it would kind of suck. I think TVA is an amazing location. It's very exciting. Uh, super Flow, Avengers Compound, just elegant and simple location. This is one of the, Avengers Compound is one of the locations that does like turn five stuff right. Uh, but, uh, for instance, you'll see at the very bottom of my tier list, I think that things that mess with tier, turn five are really bad a lot of the times. Dream Dimension, Krakoa would be down here in D tier. Uh, things like Strange Academy, I really don't like. Strange Academy's D tier. Things that just like kind of like, just feel like you're forced to play a certain way and you, there's not much agency over it kind of sucks. Uh, so that's kind of like, I don't know, we won't go through everything. Uh, there's a whole video behind it though. Uh, if you want to watch my thoughts on every single location, uh, it's on my, on my YouTube channel. TVA can go remove itself from the game. I mean, that's your opinion. I think that is one of the, I, you, if you lose on TV all the time, you should just maybe learn how to play it a little bit better and learn when to retreat when it comes up. Uh, I think the TVA is one of the most skill testing locations in the whole game. Dream Dimension, Sandbar, and Plunder Castle are probably three three of my least favorite locations of the game. They might be the bottom three, honestly. And I really hate, yeah, Dream Dimension just sucks. Krakoa is also kind of down there, dude. Krakoa is really bad too. Krakoa, because it's kind of common, it's like a lot more common than Ego, and it's just like, I don't know, who the fuck knows it happens on turn five. It's just kind of icky. Like, Ego's, Ego, I really love because it's like a cool event. Like, you get like an Ego game every week, right? Like, we get like one Ego game a week, and then you just snap and you have fun. And that's how I think you should just handle Ego. I think it's pretty cool. TV and Lamentus one. Yeah, Lamentus one is cool. The the problem with Lamentus one, I think I knocked it down a whole tier just because of its uh, interaction with death. I think if they fix its interaction with death and null and that they didn't quote unquote destroy the cards, which just gives those cards a massive boost for no reason. I think Lamentus one would be a really good location. I think they should fix the interaction with death though. It just, there's no reason for it to be there. Like it kind of makes sense, but it's just kind of stupid. Everyone should watch the video. That video actually got demonetized. 
It is my only video on the channel that got demonetized, so no offense, I don't really care if you watch it or not. <laughs> I also knew it was going to perform really poorly. Uh, but it got demonetized because I played the Final Fantasy VII soundtrack in the background, and there's this piece of garbage who... The prelude, the do 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 like that song at the beginning of like every Final Fantasy game. Uh, he goes around and he made like a version of it, and he he DMCA claims every single uh, video with it, and he demonetizes all of them. I was like looking it up on Reddit, and uh, there was hundreds of other cases of YouTubers who had it happen. Very annoying. The Mental Assault came out when the game was on a streak of like eight locations that all buffed death and wave. Yeah, that's very true. Yeah. The Mental said remove instead of destroy would be slowly fine. Yeah, I think it was just like that. That interaction is just like unneeded. And it's just like kind of bad for the game. It's the same reason why I think that Plunder Castle. Like Plunder Castle and stuff like that is bad for the game. Because it's just like randomly hyper benefits like one specific deck for seemingly no reason. I don't know, Andrew. I don't understand how it works. I don't. I don't understand. But there's the, the he the they have ownership of the song because I, I looked it up. I was like, can I can I fight this? Because I don't know. I was probably get even though it was like a really really poor performing video. You know, I could get maybe a hundred bucks of revenue off of it. Um, but multiple people said that they tried to fight it and failed. So I I it was not worth it to try and fight it. But then you can get additional scrutiny on your channel, things like that. Just, just in general, not worth it. How come I have not put anything into my chibi debris? I gotta give you some love, girl. Animated. In that way, TVA hugely skews towards early tempo decks. I don't necessarily think that. I mean, you could be running a, a ramp deck and then play wave on three into doom on four, and then you can crush people, right? I don't think it hugely favors that. I think that it's somewhat balanced in, in what it favors. And many different decks can uh, uh, find ways to, to make take advantage of it. I would say it's slightly skewed towards uh, very low power tempo decks, for sure. But there's uh, plenty of really cool things that, that you can do with TVA. And TVA, it's just like, the game's going to go really fast, man. You got you to work it out really quick. And you pretty much know exactly what you're going to play right away. Yeah, Crimson Cosmos and Big House, I both don't really like. They're both just kind of like limiting for the point, the point of being limiting. With TVA, you can totally just draw real bad. Yeah, just like any game, you know? Uh, I think that's fine. Yeah, we have She-Hulk Wave. They, they lost their wave. They might be a ramp deck or a Galactus deck, both of which losing wave for them is really bad. You think if Plunder Castle ramped from one cost to six costs of a turn, it would be incredible. Yeah, dude, Flailing Underground. You just fix that location in a really, really cool way. You can only play cards um, of the max energy of every turn. I don't know how you would say that, but Flailing Energy, that is, that is a perfect way to fix that location. I 100% agree with you. Uh, really, really smart. Uh, as someone who also likes to stream and watch videos late, thanks for using this time slot. I'm sure it's helpful for a lot of night owls as well as myself. Yo, thank you so much for the tip. I super appreciate it. Uh, it's always nice to, to have people help financially support the channel. Um, but no, Flailing Underground. That is an awesome idea for how to fix locations. Uh, fix that location. That's a really, really cool one. That, that would be a very cool location where it's like, oh, you have to play your four drop on there on four or your five drop on five. And it's like, if your opponent plays their three drop, do you just play your four drop on top of it? And then do they play their five drop? And then what do you do? That's really, really awesome. You can only play a card here if it's the only card you play this turn. Now, I don't, A, I don't think that would work from a the perspective of it, but that's not what they're saying. They're saying like on one on turn one you can only play one cost, turn two you can only play two costs. If it goes to turn seven, it can only be a seven cost, which you wouldn't be able to play. I don't know how you would word that, but uh, I would love if that was the that, if that was how that location worked. That's very very cool idea. What are locations that speed up the game? What do you think of a location that sped up the timer two x? Uh, I think that would be really bad. Um, I I don't I don't like that personally. No. 
I think that that's like un. I don't know. I don't like it. I, you look at like card, decks like cards like Nod's, Nod's Dormu and stuff like that from like Hearthstone that do the similar thing. It just kind of comes off as annoying. You know, there's already locations that are annoying enough. If you look away from your phone for two seconds, you don't see what Sokovia discards. Like, you look away from your phone for two seconds, you get back and you have two seconds to make your play. I personally wouldn't like that. Also, if you're someone who is, um, uh, you know, so, has some level, level of uh, a disability when trying to play a game like this, where uh, taking the entire term is uh, important to you and something that you kind of have to do uh, based on how you live your life, and then having it something that, that two times it would feel kind of bad. Oh, why didn't I play Wave? I'm a freaking idiot. I just didn't play Wave for no reason. I feel like they don't know how the game works. Also, I don't know if I can win. Should have just waved, man. I don't even know if wave I had a win though. The big problem. Yeah, it would just be annoying, right? It wouldn't. It would just be kind of like annoying. I don't know. I don't. I. I just. I don't like that idea. Yeah, the accessibility thing is kind of is kind of weird. Uh, does normal effects get much less problematic with turns or asynchronous though? Yeah, t definitely agree with that too. I think X Mansion is fun, but needs a tweak where it adds cards the same cost each side. I could see that being the case, yeah. X Mansion, I think I had in like C tier. It's like, okay. It happens early enough where it's like, it might flip the tide for one person, but it's not just based on your deck. It's just kind of based on a random coin flip. But also like, there, there's, there are just things in Marvel Snap that, that are meant... So, the things that are meant to cause... Uh, non-symmetry, I suppose, in the game, I think are okay. I don't know. I don't know how to say it. I think it's kind of okay if there's non-symmetry as long as it's random, not like based on the cards you select for your deck, if that makes sense. Like, for instance, like Plunder Castle, it just like super benefits people who have uh, six cost cards in their deck. Whereas something like X Mansion is just kind of like a roll. But sometimes, like, I don't know, X Mansion games can be really fun. For instance, if your opponent gets a really big card and you get a really small card, um, it can be really fun to try and then, like, fight to win by winning by a lot. It's it's just hard. I don't know. I think that I think that's not a bad, I think that's not a bad idea, uh, is what I will say. I think that that's an okay idea that you, that you just presented. Uh oh. Hope you didn't want all those spaces. Lockjaw's kind of cracked though, too. We actually don't really know what we can get from the deck that's all that good though. Oh, what's behind door number one? We are we are just messing with this invisible woman left and right, dude. Maybe we do this and then it pulls the Enchantress and turns it off completely. That'd be fun. Uh, John Gallant says they should do a location that reveals based on reverse priority. I think that would be a totally fine. Um, I think that would be a totally fine location that, that no one would be super upset about. They're just looking at top deck Hella. Hmm. We're just going to try and play Chavez, huh? Chavez and then play a 16 power. I think they Chavez left and then play a 16 power. Hmm. Actually, this this always wins, I believe. So if they Sheva is right, wait, 
Was? I think this always wins. I think this always wins. Marvel calculate before Drac will calculate afterwards. Yeah, we just have to beat the, uh, they top decked Hella? Piece of shit. We actually went and did the damn thing. Nice dance, Captain Marvel. Reverse Nexus, this location is the combined power of the other two. Like this location has the combined power of the other two. Uh, I don't know, would that be fun? I don't know if that would be fun. I feel like, okay. The priority flipping location is a fine location, in my opinion. Like that's just a kind of a nothing burger that's just kind of like cool. Sandbar should just have read only one card can be played right here by each player per turn. It's just a completely different location, right? It's just that it doesn't even like uh, come out to be like similar at all. Like a location like that is fine. It's kind of a nothing burger location that doesn't really do anything, but. Oh. Oggy woggy. We got into the sandbar chat. Let's snap for no reason. Bar with no name, but affecting the entire match. That's the horrible, dude. <laughs> Sounds terrible. Living Tribunal's effect would seem like it would be a cool location instead of a card. I think as a card, it's really interesting. Because you can try and just make like some crazy, crazy big thing and then play uh, Living Tribunal. Like there, I think that there's a lot of interesting ideas that come from doing something like that. Uh, sick, dude. We love Krakoa here. Big Krakoa fans. Speak of the devil, am I right? Wait, say your thing. Say the thing. There you go. Do you have to drop him? When does he do it? Say your line. Nice. He said flame on chat. The sand, th this is based on, um, I thought that this was what, uh, this isn't like She-Hulk, right? This isn't the first episode of She-Hulk. This is the, the place that, uh, She-Hulk and the Hulk get hammered. Right? Yeah, I hate Sandbar. I think Sandbar is uh, dog water. Dog water location. It looks just like it. If it's not, if it's, if that's not it, I think that that's like the point because because the Hulks. Correction, they get smashed. That's a good joke right there, Drewski. That's why they made it the worst location space on the worst show. She-Hulk might be the worst show. I really didn't vibe with Hawkeye. If I'm keeping it real with you. I th I thought that the... I thought that the girl... Oh, one power rocks in the sandbar? I thought that the new girl was okay. It has Black Widow's sister, who I'm kind of... Who's like the only girl that I'm a simp for in the whole MCU. But, um, I don't know, man. Should it be Hulk or She-Hulk themed? It is Hulk themed. Hulk doesn't have abilities. Would like an inverted mojo world? Nah, that would just be, uh, I feel like that would just be bad, right? You just wouldn't play there. It would just end up essentially being bar with no, no name. Because you, if you had zero cards there, you would win.
think we're going to win the sandbar with a single point of power there? Or do you think they're going to get Hella? I think that 18 left should be able to win here, right? We have 19 left. Even better. If they have Hella again, I'm going to be pissed, dude. Is it the same dude? Or they're just going to try and play APOC left for Gucci. Fuck you, man. Fuck you, dude. <laughs> Honestly, <laughs> stop playing. Stop getting hella. <laughs> stop it. <laughs> stop just randomly discarding cards and still being able to play hella, you piece. Plus, we lost. We missed a fit. We missed a 50 50 there. It was probably even worse. Doctor Doom discovers is disrespectful. I didn't mean that. That dude's probably fine. They're just playing Hella. They're just having a good time. I'm just letting my frustrations for this game uh, overflow. That's not something I should be doing, you know? Yeah, I wonder if a deck with like Colleen, Wing, Wolverine, S Swarm, Nova, Killmonger would be good. What do you guys think about that? Your thoughts. Would you say that I'm facing a hell of a lot of hella? Is that what you what you would say? Would you think? You get it? You get it? Nah, dude, they're cool. You can play Hell all you want. Hell's a fun deck. Finally. Peace. You. What the hell, man? Mm. I don't even know if I can win. Raft Hella. I thought I would be able to win right, but okay, I can't win right. I snapped thinking that I could win right, but I, I cannot. Dude. You should get Galactus? Yeah. Galactus is a fun card, man. Marie Hill value. Shut the fuck up. Shut your mouth. play at the sandbar tactically lowering our MMR chat
Maria, Maria Hill haters will remind me of this. It's it's like it's mocking me, dude. Sandbar gonna be here for two days now. It's only twenty four hours now. MMR snapshot of infant, son of a bitch. <laughs> All right. Well, now, even if we get it, uh, the Nexus gives us some uh, some stuff. Battle mode of my future? No, we're fine. We're only gonna be playing for about forty five more minutes anyway, and then we're doing uh, D Binksy Variety Hour. D Binksy Variety Hour. You get any location that holds Patriot? What's wrong with Patriot? There's nothing wrong with Patriot. It's okay to be a strong deck. Seems good. Seems pretty, pretty good. Um, let's just go pass into like She Hulk, Maria Hill. I guess we can Maria Hill at minus two and like She Hulk one drop into Chavez. I don't know how they beat this though. We would like Doom Odin. They're in a pretty rough spot. They, can't, they shouldn't be able to beat us right or left. Pretty, kind of close, actually. Wait, Doom Odin might beat us, dude. F and A, dude. You, man. Chantress is just better, right? Chantress is minus is 14 total power. This should win us middle and uh, middle and left. I think we still win middle, middle and uh, left. It's Toit though. Toit like Toyga. Boom. Oh, this Enchantress value, chat. Look at all that Enchantress value. So juicy. Victory. Juicy. Why did I hit monkey? I didn't want the rocks in my deck. Why would I want to add three rocks to my deck? What are you, crazy? Why would I want to add three rocks to my deck? What are you, insane? Win Chantress, so true. You guys would have added three rocks to your deck there for no reason. So silly. Everyone's just forfeiting on Sandbar. I've been doing it quite a bit today as well. I, I hate it. It's a terrible location. Uh, no, I'm not gonna spend money on Sturgeon. That'd be that'd be wild. Look at this. Tactically, Scarlet Witching right, to, so that even if this is supposed to be the uh, hot location, it's not. Handful rocks is actually better than deckful rocks. So true. We do it for the monkey scream. The monkey scream is pretty nice. You're not wrong. Atara Snapu. Oh. Pretty sick with it. Pretty exciting. Rhea Hill Hood. Storm! There's a storm coming, Mr. Wayne. Alright, remember, if this turns into flooding, we still have an extra location. Always remember. 
does not. Turns into Atlantis. Okay. Ooh, is Enchantress just our best play here? Minus two, six power. Two, three. This is the most seven. But we can Polaris afterwards, right? One, two, one, two, three. I think we're just Enchantress. Enchantress, let me hopefully Polaris something off of it. Juggernaut, you cheater. A She-Hulk, that was so good. That's right, their Thanos can no longer be full power chat. Thank you so much for the uh, membership, Kyle. I, I'm glad that you enjoy the, the, glad that you're enjoying it. Would've been really screwed had we played Sinister. Sinister's only two because of the Soul Stone. Like, uh, we could have thought about... Bitch. We could have thought about, like, potentially... God damn it, dude. Potentially, like, Rocket Raccoon, Mr. Sinister in there. Wow. Oh, it snapped us? Based? I always want to, like, try and win. Now that they snapped us. Because what if they just don't play left, right? And then we hit the one and three of pulling this over. And then we still somehow win. Because they only play one card and their one card is dog shit. What's life without a little Mimsy, right? Fuck. There was a world where that could have worked yet. Carnage mid wins for them? Pretty good. The problem with the Captain Marvel is that Captain Marvel would have jumped right. Also, Marvel Sinister is seven energy. Unusual list? Well, what's special about it, do you think? What would you say is unique about all the characters in it? The thumbnail and title of the stream might help you as well. Where did Palaz go to 10? Sure, dude. Have you? How quickly? How quickly, Chad? Have people forgotten about this card? <laughs> how how quickly has Shuri become an afterthought to everyone? Italian? What a garbage friggin' uh, location, dude! They're all Marvel characters. So true. The Thanos list was weird. Yeah, I don't know what they were doing. The Juggernaut was kind of, the Storm Juggernaut was kind of psycho. Look at all my buffed cards, chat. Um, okay, it's probably just like a pretty basic Dino Collector kind of, kind of sitch we got going on here. Did you manage to find some synergy about these cards? Yeah, it's just kind of like a good cards, good cards, wave She-Hulk deck. What the fuck? It's just a Coulson card? They just played? <laughs> just played it? What a crazy person. Hopefully they play Dinosaur this turn. Trying to be the nuts for us. What? Oh, this is their Agent 13. This was their Coulson card. World first crystal chat? <laughs> 
World first crystal played against me? It's not a real crystal though, it is an Agent Coulson crystal. Ooh, not not a good call. They should have played a Sentinel right for sure. Stopping my uh my Captain Marvel from being able to jump. But doesn't matter, chat. We get that dub. Victory. Retreating to boost crystal win percentage to artificially make it seem like she's good. Dude, that's that's the next level, bro. Yeah, Crystal at the 14 games that Crystal's been played, adding a single loss is kinda kinda catastrophic to the win rate. They did do the crystal negative. That that is true. Wish they show the negative effect on the cards. I also wish that it wasn't just on your side. It is cool at least it's on your side though, so when you're playing, you can see it. Super villain shit, make sure Crystal never gets buffed. Oh, one power rock chat? How many times has this okay Okoye given us a one power rock? It's kind of crazy. Wasn't Index is gonna fly under the radar? Yeah, that's actually a good point. Well, does if it doesn't start in your deck, does it still affect the played win rate? Probably not. Probably only tracks cards that start in your deck. Oh. What the hell, man? They district decks my Okoye deck, you piece. That should that should be illegal. There's <laughs> I was rewatching a clip. I don't remember what. Um, I don't remember the full context of the clip. But um, at one point, I just said it should be illegal to play arrow. <laughs> it's just, it's just so stupid. Because they arrowed me, and I was just like, it's, there should be a rule where you can't play arrow. It's, it's just so dumb. Just getting mad at what my opponent did and just saying that because I didn't like what they said, they they should create a rule where they just can't play the card. Oh, Clutch City, dude. Actually, let's win all three lanes profit. Electra here. What's the, what's our famous saying, chat? Win all three lanes. Profit! That's right. That's right. That's the saying. Apparently, actually, when Darkhawk loses its ability, it's a pretty bad card. It's kind of like a Dracula that doesn't uh, that doesn't get to uh, discard a card. Pretty bad card. Would not recommend. In most cases. I'm actually super excited to play Spelunky here in a half hour. I uh, I got Spelun the original Spelunky, Spelunky HD, for like, I think it was like a dollar and 60 cents on my PS5. No, it was, it was like two fifty. It was two dollars and 50 cents. It was on sale on the PS5. And uh, I, I went back and, yes, yeah, four zero Darkhawk needs a buff, so true. Darkhawk, Iron Man cards that are bad when they lose their ongoing effects. So true and based. We'll hide the Polaris left. It's actually kind of kind of cheeky. On snaps, fine. Maybe should be adding more here, but I'm just I'm just simply not going to. Actually, totally fine. We're gonna pull the sunspot and just ruin their life. Actually, just 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 simply completely fine. Unless they fulfill. But uh, Captain Marvel should be able to take care of right no matter what. I think we're going to be okay here. Oh, it's just hard running the hole. It's actually quite funny. Super scroll. Nice. Uh... By the way, nice super scroll. Nice Patriot. Be a shame if both of them were turned off. 
be an awful shame. Uh, we beat Doom, surprisingly enough. That's why we played the Captain Marvel. So Captain Marvel would have beaten the Doom had they, had they played it. And we just destroyed them. We just, we just beat the beat the snot out of them. Just, uh, just beat them up, chat. Beat them up. Just simply destroy them. Being able to pull that, uh, being able to pull that sunspot was really nice. Yo, it's Q. Yeah, Nightpot gets mad when you spam, and Nightpot Night gets mad when you uh, do caps. Really like a two drop? Maria Hill. Best two drop in the game. Couldn't have asked for more. That, that was a weird snap. Because I actually, I think I'm going to lose. Because I didn't draw any other good cards. If they just She-Hulk here, though, we lose. That's okay. We'll let it ride. We'll let it ride for four. Doom! Yeah. That's why That's why it was so bad. Uh, only being able to play the wave there. I think if I had, like, any other draw, it was fine. You want me to add Mystique to the deck? Weird, what a weird thing to say. They leadered, they were ahead, so their Electro could, would went, go off and then mine would go off. And so the, could, it was either a tie or I lose. That was just rough. Is there a way to watch the battle thing you did with Canvas? Yeah. I was thinking about getting it like edited down. I might do that eventually, but um, the big problem with it is that it's just like, I, I did that before we and it did are not, the um, wieners, my... are they hosting, uh, they're hosting D-Money right now. Uh, t -t -t -t. Do they only have clips? Actually, you can't. I'll, uh... Man, dude. I am gonna have to post it then. I'll, uh, I'll ask him about it. Wait, they might have... Snap. I might have posted it all on YouTube already. Oh, yes. It is here. Uh, you can watch the full one. It's three hours and 30 minutes on the dot. That's actually exactly how long we were trying to make it. Perfect. Um, we go with here. There's the Polaris. Sardex could be good. Yeah, Sardex could be good. All right, we just have to hope that they play a Patriot. And then we uh, Enchantress said Patriot. So I guess that's their that's their thing. That's how, that's how they're gonna try and win. Not nah, fishing worth. Most people here are pretty mature. Let's say in general. That's not Citadel. 
Minerva. Hi. What, you're going to night sleep already? He's choking me, chat. Call the call the police. Babe, look at my deck. It's all women. A deck of all women. Oh. No. Amazing. Are you impressed by me for doing that? Yes. Would you call me a hero? <laughs> what? That makes sense. It does. It would make me happy, yes. I'll do it. They pulled my rock! That was a one and three piece. Oh my gosh, it's a little Lilith. Look at Lilith, that's my dog. Oh, what a good paw! Wow. She did a good blem? She did a wiggly blem? Do you, do you guys' dogs ever do blems where their tongue is like slightly sticking out of their mouth? Uh, Kyle, I'm not streaming Friday. Uh, exhibition point schedule. I don't have, I don't, that one might not be on the YouTube. But schedule is uh, Sunday through Wednesday, 9 p.m. Central Time. Uh, Thursday, 3 p.m. Central Time. Stream the next two days. Really cute dog. I think she's cool too. Look at her. She has a little paw on my shoulder. She does love her dada. Her best friends in many ways. Many people are saying this. A little kiss? Oh, wow. Thank you so much for the little nose kiss. We can, um, we can try and do... Shuri 2 drop on Bar Sinister at the end of the game. That could win us the game. It does work on uh does work on YouTube. Look at that. Or oh. watching to the door. Oh Solomon. Oh, you're so Solomon, did you walk into the door? The dog walked into the door. Maybe there's Sunday, dude. Looking forward to it. I've never had the. Uh... Look at this, by the way. Agent Thirteen Quinjet into Daily Bugle. Absolutely pogging out of my out of my freaking gourd. They just Patriot left? You ever heard of my Lord and Savior Enchantress? How do you pay for dog food? Well, that's a weird question. I don't quite know how to answer it. It's clobbering time. What is it? 25% chance to hit the Enchantress? Shaka, Squirrel Girl. Oh, Mio Mayo chat. We might still lose. So they have six. They have not. No, we're gonna get quite a bit middle. I think it's gonna be pretty tough to lose this one. Very nice. I think we're gonna be fine. I think we should win middle. 
Ooh, how unfortunate for you. Look at them go down one at a time. Bloop. 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 <laughs> Bloop. <laughs> oh man, you love to see it. <laughs> you love to see it. That's strange. Why do the Patriots not get any power boost for losing the abilities? I get, yeah, they should, right? So this one should start getting it. Maybe it just waits for all of it to resolve. I think I think the Enchantress just wait. Maybe like this, since this is still resolving, it doesn't get the power added. Yeah, so they, they might have like, did they flicker? They must have flickered really fast. Easy game. Easy game. Why do Patriot players never expect Enchantress? Dude, Patriot players have had it good, man. Rogue and Enchantress have been very outside of the meta for quite a while. Uh, quite a while, but both Rogue and Enchantress have been outside of the meta. So it's probably just that. Great example of exclamation point profit. So incredibly true. Cheap Enchantress is in my store? Yo, dude. I, I would I would grab it, man. Cheap Enchantress kind of cracked. Kind of cracked. Patriot took the infant this season. It's a great deck. Patriot was when I was going through pool three, which was, mind you, 10 months ago. <laughs> really long time ago. That's probably not true. I think I finished pool three like at the beginning of November, maybe. Like six months ago. Patriot was my most wanted pool three card the whole time. I was really excited to play Patriot. Sandbar is a hot location, a huge amount of Patriots, so Enchantress is really strong. I concur with you. I, I most definitely concur. I think we're snapping. We're just getting so much Shuri's lab value here. We're getting an absolutely buck wild amount of Shuri's, Shuri's lab value. Plus, look at this, we have two cards with no abilities in our hand. If only we had another sandbar location. There's a Nick Furry in your shop and he's a bear? Kind of badass. Bit rude of my opponent to play She-Hulk, honestly, when you think about it, you know? Probably be a rule where you're just not allowed to do that. But uh, waving a She-Hulk Marvel should be enough to do it. They waved me? I wave you, bro. Why not keep Rickety Bridge for Captain Marvel? Why Why not Why not find something better to do than just uh, uh, get mad at everything that I play? <laughs> Nice! I'm just kidding. That was that was unnecessary. That was unnecessary anger thrown at you. I know you're just uh, you're just trying to inquisitively ask about my plays. <laughs> I apologize. People are catching people are catching strays today. <laughs> no, 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 you're fine. I was <laughs> I was being a dick. I was being a see you next Tuesday. Um, <laughs> don't worry, I'm, I'm aware. I'm aware. I'm aware of how I'm acting. That, that is a really good point, though, with Captain Marvel. Did I have it in hand? I don't think I had it in hand at that point. Uh, by the time I played it. If I had it in hand, it's something to be worth worth noting. But so many decks are running, like, Doctor Doom. There's Squirrel Girl, Ultron stuff going. I don't think, like, keeping stuff like that open is uh, in my best interest in general. We tried the new Mill deck. There, what do you mean the new mill deck? Would, would love to hear your thoughts. Oh, it's everyone's favorite location, Plunder Castle, chat. Fuck. We'll go Koya because we have the Polaris follow up. 
Mill decks aren't new. I mean, mill decks are well, bad. Mill decks are horrific in uh, Marvel Snap. So I'm interested to see what they mean. Because like, there's there's really no reason to ever play a mill deck. Uh, even when you, the, the the amount of time it takes to actually get a mill to happen, and the payoff of said mill are so different, that it's just it doesn't matter. Damn it, dude. Gotta love a Plunder Castle sandbar game. Gotta love a Plunder Castle sandbar game. We can fulfill the bluff most likely here though. Make sure dog is way too cute, so I'd like to donate on Sunday for some dog food. Uh yeah, I mean, well, first of all, I never feel like you have to uh pay anything onto the channel. I uh try and provide all of my content for hundred percent free uh, to everyone, so never feel like you have to. But uh yeah, I mean, uh, it's, uh, donating directly through PayPal is the best way, if, if that is something that you do want to do. But uh, do note that I I find it very important to keep my f uh, streams as free as possible. Okay, so we have to worry about... Blue Marvel. Let's just go all right and deal with it later. Okay. They play all the stones? Dude, they played all six stones, chat. As if. Alright. Oh, chat. This is so good. Opponent has pri- Oh, shit. The fucking uh, daredevil. Eh? It's okay. This is still good. I was going to say opponent has priority, so they're, they're, they're freaking screwed. But, uh... <laughs> I didn't realize they played Daredevil, so the snap was kind of stupid. Because I was just going to play Enchantress, because if they had just played Blue Marvel, then I would Enchantress the Power Stone, Soul Stone, and Blue Marvel. I feel like they didn't uh, think that one through. There's no six cost card they can play that affects other cards, right? Unless they have Galactus. The only thing I lose to is Galactus, no? Spectrum. Spectrum is an 11 power card. You can tie it. <laughs> this is just going to be a tie. Oh, I actually lost. Why'd you guys say Spectrum? All I had to do was play left, you piece. Blue Marvel, Kazar. Why'd you guys all lie to me? Let's see, who all said Spectrum? You guys can all pay individually. Okay. Ifrit Sama, you owe me a cube. Sparkle Sniff, you owe me a cube. Java Nubal. Java Nubi, you owe me a cube. Uh, I don't know how to say your name because it's in a different language. You owe me a cube. I am Grum. You owe me a cube. Legacy, you owe me a cube. Jimmy Dickens, you owe me a cube. Jude Fraud, you owe me a cube. King Carta, you owe me a cube. Satya doesn't know what Plunder Castle is. Give me your cubes. Send them right now. You did lose to Spectrum? I didn't. It was a tie. The opponent is a... By the way... The opponent is an absolute psychopath by not playing around me playing a single card left. <laughs> Donate to me, keeps it. It's alright. This is the best part about being in, uh, in infinite, right? Nothing matters. Thank you, King Karta. Appreciate you. Do you have to trust that your opponent doesn't suck? Dude, it's it's so hard, man. Wait, no, because it was Professor X. I was wondering if I played biggest card left and then we won by middle on Spectrum. I just, I don't even think that was uh, the case. What's a mill deck? I don't know. Someone asked if I'd seen the new mill deck and then uh, they didn't say anything. A mill deck means that you um, destroy your opponent's deck. So you essentially use things like Yondu Cable 
Mantis to um, destroy your opponent's deck. I was actually, interestingly enough, the first person in Marvel Snap history to mill someone on turn three. A little fun little factoid for you. Lobster posted anyone? Is his name Fresh Lobster? Is that, is that? Fresh Lobster. Turbo Mill? This deck is, is horrible, by the way. <laughs> is, there's no way this deck is consistent and or strong. <laughs> Fresh Lobster has some really cool ideas, though. But this, there's no... You can't make a mill deck work in Marvel Snap. You pulled a turn two mill? Is it Sinister London? Someone on Reddit uh, posted a turn two mill. It was really cool. It's funny taking your opponent's cards. I definitely agree with that. The mill strategy just doesn't work in Marvel Snap, though. There's just like, you don't get any payoff for it. That's just, it's just like a beast hit monkey deck with a bunch of like non-optimal cards. It can be definitely fun, though. It also just has good cards in the deck. I don't know. It has freaking Baron Mordo, dude. <laughs> What's up, YouTuber? It has Baron Mordo and it runs Falcon, which I think is, I guess, okay. It has Mantis and Yandu. I mean, like, if you you could just play, like, better cards and it's just, like, a way better deck. I don't think the milling thing actually does anything. You can just make that deck way better by just not pretending to do the mill thing. Also, like, Cable and Mantis, don't they clog your hand for Beast? Yeah, okay, just fun fundamentally I disagree that that deck can be any good. But, that is that is why we, we play Marvel Snap sometimes. It is indeed. Okay. How do we win, though? Big, big question. We're winning on total power, right? So if we just go, like, here... Here? Maybe we're fine? I'm winning that much. We're winning by 10. If leader that Thanos would have been 10 power 20, it would have been uh, 10 power. Thanks, Kyle. I appreciate that, man. So, always nice to help uh, financially support the channel. Like I said, it's no big deal, but I appreciate it nonetheless. You don't think the idea is for is for it to be good? Yeah, I, I can see that. I just I don't know, man. I I mess around with mill for a long time. I just don't. Uh, I, I, I don't I don't get it I suppose. You're playing cards that give one side information. I mean that's not good in Marvel Snap. Cool like, deck idea. I mean don't get me wrong. I just think that saying that it's like strong, consistent, and good is just I mean it's just wrong. <laughs> but uh, I guess it's working for you. It's working for you. You know. Put Darkhawk in your mill deck. Yeah, probably. Sometimes irritating your opponent is more fun than winning. Ooh, nice Ant Man, you piece. Agent 13, Sunspot? On? The pup's name? I have two. It's uh, Lilith and Saul. You can see them. My emotes. You actually have two emotes for each of them, Kyle. Like Saul Goodman, yeah, in many ways. You have Saul, Lilith Dragon, which is a picture of Lilith wearing a dragon costume. 
Uh, we have Bink Saul, which is Saul inquisitively lifting his ear. We have Bink's Cosmo, which is Saul as Cosmo the dog, and then we have Bink's Lilith, which is just Lilith being a doggo. Just being a just, just being a dog in general, you know what I mean? Uh, our She-Hulk never dies. There's actually like a glitch where She-Hulk won't die in the Danger Room. It's pretty sweet. It's important to know if you're going to play against Danger Room. It's an important thing to do. Me when I get the one side information that I found as a better game plan. Yo, Shanna deck, Pog. They bastard their hand. Probably not good. See, the She-Hulk thing worked. Isn't that crazy? Get over here, you piece. All right, Kazar middle, float two for the sunspot. High right. I guess I could have Squirrel Girl. Squirrel Girl is a bit scary. Squirrel Girl might be a bit scary. Dude, ghost value, by the way. Did you guys see the insane ghost value that my opponent got there? The ghost value is actually out of control. Would we have had priority if, if they didn't have ghost? No, we would have had priority either way. That would have been kind of nuts. Yeah, that was a that was a Shanna ghost. It wouldn't have mattered. All right, let me um, a little self promotion here. Hello, my name is Binks. Thank you so much for being here. And this is a really cool deck. After this self promotion, I'm gonna play a uh, ad for Felicity for her tournament. Let me let me actually pull up uh, the information for it and throw it on stream. So Felicity is an amazing member of the Marvel Snap community. She does a lot of things to help uplift and just kind of like, um, I guess feature a lot of different people and make sure that our community is incredibly inclusive. Uh, I've worked with her on a couple of things in the past. Um, so I've worked with her on, uh, I worked on her podcast before. Uh, we, we've just kind of like talked a lot on the back end just about content creation, things like that. She's just like a really, really good person. Uh, and she is running an all-female tournament at uh, the end of the week. Give me a second here. And this. Uh, I know where. Short on stream really fast. So she's running an all-female invitational tournament called the Quantum Cup. Uh, there's only female cards allowed. That's kind of why I was doing the all-female deck today to raise some awareness for this tournament. Uh, in my YouTube video on Thursday, I will also be running the ad and just kind of uh, dropping this a little bit more. But it is on April 29th on Felicity's Twitch channel. Uh, it has eight amazing badass women of Marvel Snap who are all playing uh, with all-female decks. And then Felicity and Nina is new to... Uh, amazing Marvel Snap content creators will be co-hosting and casting it. So, will be a really, really awesome time. Uh, would super recommend anyone who is interested in going out and checking this out. Um, I think that um, I'll let Felicity talk about it more because I think as a guy, that I don't have too much to say on this issue. But I do think that female inclusion in gaming and especially in a lot of gaming spaces is something that's really overlooked and is uh, very, very hard. Uh, on females in the community uh, and I think that any way that uh, you can uplift and, and help you, you know bring uh, more eyes on things like this I think it's just really important to build a diverse and amazing community as a whole uh, so I want to try and use my platform to help this as much as possible so 
uh, definitely consider uh, checking out this women's invitational uh, I'm gonna post my socials so uh, if you're interested in checking out my socials uh, going to do that uh, and I'm also gonna play an ad right now uh, that Felicity prepared to talk to you a little bit about the tournament and why it is important to her uh, so we're gonna go ahead and play that for y'all uh, it is gonna be recorded and posted on our YouTube channel so if you want to uh, follow it up and watch it afterwards you're, you're welcome to do so uh, but let me go ahead and pull this up uh, I will duck out for a quick second and talk to D Money, but I'm going to play you guys a quick uh, video that Felicity prepared. Hey everyone, I'm Felicity and I'm super excited to announce the Quantum Cup Women's Invitation. Hey everyone. My guess. Everyone, I'm. Hey everyone. I'm Felicity and I'm super excited to announce the Quantum Cup Women's Invitational Tournament that's happening on Saturday, April 29th at 2 p.m. Eastern. We've got a lineup of eight badass women who are going to be split into two groups. They will play each person in their group and then the two finalists will then battle it out to see who will win the tournament. I'm hosting this tournament because I really wanted to celebrate the hardworking, awesome women content creators in the Marvel Snap community on Twitch and to celebrate women in general. The eight lovely ladies who will be playing in the tournament will be Eggs for Sale, Kai Berries, Z3 underscore, KK Sparkles, Helen of Toy, Hannah's Cat Cafe, Nicolina, and Pawnee Pun. The wonderful Nina is Noob will be co-casting with me. The players can only use cards that feature women or female characters and they must be series 3 and below. I am super excited to see what kind of decks that the players will bring and I hope you will all tune in to check it out. Hey everyone, I'm Felicity. Also, that was Felicity. She's she's amazing. Like I said, uh, you will see if you watch me on YouTube, uh, you can catch. Uh, I will, I'll be putting this ad and running this deck uh, on there as well on uh, Thursday. Um, definitely go out and support. It's on Saturday. I'll, I'll show you one more time uh, on Felicity's. So Twitch, let me go ahead and throw it in chat. Actually, I'll do be a boomer and just type it out. Slash Felicity. Uh, so give her a follow, check it out on Saturday. Uh, really, really awesome event. Yeah, Nina is new, Felicity, both both awesome. All, all the ladies here are, are incredible content creators. Uh, so definitely give that a watch. Uh, we're going to connect here with D-Money, and we're going to start playing some Spelunky. Uh, let me go ahead and give him a call. Odd restriction on the series? Yeah, it's it's more about uh yo, D Money, are you there? Oh, what's up? Hey yo. How we doing? Yeah, it's it's to make it uh, easier for people to um or it's more boy, Bing, accessible. Back at it again with another video. Uh, back at it again <laughs> with the <laughs> white vans. All right. What is up? I'm kind of scared, bro. You are scared of Spelunky? There's no reason to be scared. Like I feel like you're a god at this game or something. I don't know. I'm absolutely not a god at this game. I've played this exactly one time on stream since I started playing okay. Snap, and I got through the first world a single time. Uh, so I am not, I am not good at this game. Don't worry. I'm pretty, I'm pretty good at the OG. The OG I've beaten a couple of times. Oh, damn. You know what um, I'm doing. But I never beat this one. Yeah, I did not come close to being the OG one. But I did play that one quite a bit in college uh, with, my, with my friends, and that was... It was a great time. I have I've only played sixty runs on this game here. Not um, too shabby. The OG one is one of the best games of all time, in my opinion. It is just like this beautifully put together game that just like oh, it's, it's great. Well, this one has online, so let's go. This this one does have online, <laughs> man. Well, two is two is really good too. Two might be better, but like one was just like super ahead of its time because it came out like what twenty eleven or something like that uh, yeah. on like Xbox Xbox Arcade. Uh, and it's just like super, super ahead of its time. Must have been 2013, I think. But I was playing it in college. I don't know. I don't know. It was sometime. I it, it, yeah. ex it existed at, at one point or another, you know? Uh, but I, I think that our goal should be to get through Olmec. So, like, there's like a middle Olmec fight after the second world. I think if we get through that, I, w I would feel pretty proud of us. Or we could just right. beat the whole game. That'd be pretty sick, yeah, too. Yeah, I mean, that, that, that's. 
Totally, yeah. I'm trying to get through the first. I'm trying to get through the first world here. First, uh, mm -hmm. I don't even know. I don't know how far I've ever gotten. Might be a little brutal, but let's go. Binks will carry me. Easy, dude. Sorry, I'm just making sure I get all my uh, dang freaking YouTube changed. Making sure that I get my Twitch changed. You're Sorry if good. that's loud, chat. Sorry if that's loud. 7-99 or bust? Yeah. Oh, dude. One of one of my favorite streamers, his name is uh, Dan Giesling. He actually used to be a big brother person. Uh, he's, he's one of the best big brother players of all time, actually. Interestingly enough. Um, and he plays Spelunky? Yeah, he just beat... He just beat... Um, 1099 for the first time. Damn. Uh, and it was crazy, dude. It took him like hundreds of hours. It was it was actually insane. I have seen the uh like end game and it does look it does look crazy. Yeah. Looks like a and... hell of a grind too. Yeah. yeah, crazy grind, dude. I mean you basically like you know there's what? There's what four levels in the first one, there's like four, four, one, four, four. There's four, four, one, four, one, four. So there's like 20 something what? levels. And then the <laughs> secret level, there's like six. And then you just have to do 99 levels in a row. Like after doing like 20 levels, it's it's crazy. Uh, I don't think I would ever, ever try and do that. Um, Chat, how can you can you give me an idea? How does uh, how does D money sound? And hello, how, hello, how, hello. How, how, how does the, the game music sound? Yeah, how does Bink sound? How does Bink sound? Testing one two three. Testing one two three. What's up? What's up? Oh no! I died again. Ah! Just warming up. Just warming up. Just warming up. <laughs> Love his voice, dude. You got you got some fans in the chat, man. Let's Ooh, go. Thank you. Thank you. Uh, okay. People are saying it sounds good. That's always good. My screen adjusted. So when was the last time you played this? Ah. Uh, I'm gonna say, multiple years ago. Multiple years ago? Oh, jeez. <laughs> he money sounds handsome. Oh, Paul. Hey, I mean, hey. I don't know. I don't know. You're gonna have to come by my stream and find out. You know. Oh, look at hey. that. Twitch on TV slash D money. That, it's just D money, right? You get. You, weren't you in there like early? How long have you been yeah, streaming just, for? Just D money. It used to be D money games. That is my. Uh, that is my YouTube as well. Uh, but yeah, I've been streaming for. Jeez, how long now? Uh, maybe like. I mean, overall, like I used to stream like way back and like get zero viewers and like very inconsistent kind of stuff. But then, uh, then I streamed for 630 days straight. Um, and now it's been like a, maybe, maybe a year since then, a year and a half since then. So maybe like four years now. I, I don't know. It's kind of like basically when, when COVID started, whenever COVID started. Yeah. Correct me if I'm wrong. Are you are you dating Z3 underscore? Is that correct? I am. Yes. Okay. Awesome. <laughs> who, who is competing in the tournament this Saturday? I just played. Uh, I just played. I had Felicity. I'm gonna put uh, an ad for it in uh, my YouTube video, but I just played an ad for the stream about. Uh, Let's go. That tournament. But yeah, anyone on D Money stream? Uh, Twitch.tv slash Felicity. This uh, this Saturday at uh, at 2 p.m. Uh, an amazing tournament, all female invitational. Super super cool. Definitely check it out. All females playing with all females. Yeah, all female in their, cards. In their decks, yeah. I actually was playing all female deck today uh, in celebration. Nice. <laughs> I did that on uh, International Women's Day Hell as yeah, well. Dude. I was like, I will get a win with an all women deck for the women. It Love took it. a while, but I got it. Yeah, it's it like well, <laughs> that with like She-Hulk and Wave is kind of kind of cracked, right? Yeah, like, I think it was harder before uh, when yeah, I did it. Yeah, yeah now there's <laughs> more cards out. Okay. Online, uh, adventure online. Okay. Let me try and get you in here. Are we Steam friends? We must be, right? I don't, well, no, because we've only played, I think we, we found, we became friends in client. <laughs> yeah. For Rocket Invite. League, I think. Okay, what is your Steam name? Uh, Demon. Invite anyone to play. Share a link with anyone and they can join your game using remote play. What the? F uh, okay. I can give you my friend Search. code it, or something. Is it just D money with no anything? It is just D money. Yeah, that might be hard to find because there's a million probably. Yeah, <laughs> okay, we're gonna add a friend here. Yeah, yeah. Send me the send me the friend code. Yeah, I got you. 
Put that friend code. Wait, is this showing on stream? Okay. Press send it. I'm scared of it showing on stream, but uh, I mean anybody could stuff see my Steam profile. Sorry. Oh my gosh, no! And then they're they're gonna they're gonna get you. They're gonna they're gonna <laughs> write on my profile. <laughs> they're gonna get you. Man. <laughs> oh, D money, send invite, pawn. Let's go. All right, I got okay. you. And then we go here, and then we go out of this. Here to return to game. Sick. Invite. Uh, invite. E money. Invite to play. Yeah. I got you. Let's do it. The walls are shifting. Yo, let's go, dude. We're so good at co-op stream. Hell yeah. We actually haven't really hit any bad errors yet, and I was always yep. really scared about that uh, when we when we started talking about this because the best co-op stream on Twitch. Best co-op stream on Twitch, baby. Oh yeah, yeah. Dude, you use the fucking nerd archaeologist? Hell yeah. What the hell? <laughs> you know, he looks like he knows what he's doing, because I surely uh -huh. don't know. I know a little All right. bit. Look at this, dude. Not even too much... Uh, oh too yeah, so we can, we can actually time. hit each other. As we well. can hit each other, yeah. Um. Yeah, I gotta get familiar with these controls again here. Forget yeah, the, fir the first those. few games I'm sure are just gonna be a bit of a nightmare. Oh, I used a rope. How do I pick him up? Uh, you hold down and then you, uh, oh, I'm almost dead. All right. Oh, this yeah, is just yeah, gotcha. you, oh, oh, you killed me, you <laughs> piece of shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I was just trying to. <laughs> <laughs> <Fuck you. laughs> just fucking yeet. That was unintentional. So after you die, you turn into a ghost, so I can, like, affect things lightly as a uh, ghost. Um. Oh. I mean, we could just restart if we want. Uh, you'll point. die really soon. It's okay. What? I, I can do some things as a ghost too. Like I can uh, pop this and make it so that. Uh, oh shit! You're trying to kill make me. Make it so that the ghost comes after you. Oh shit! I gotta get to the exit. <laughs> <laughs> All just get some, go. put some pep in your step, you know, a little bit. <laughs> Slunky two co-op is actually uh, chaos, dude. Wait, so you don't come back? Uh, no, I. Oh. I believe there's something that, that I think if you get one of these, oh, there I you are. Back. Let's yeah, go. Yeah, yeah. Calculate. Uh, now you have all my stuff. But that's fine. You can have my stuff. Uh, how much money you got? Do we share money? Got, oh man. I got 10k. Should we kill the guy in the shop? Uh, no. I do not think we should try I and kill the shopkeeper. That. Yeah, but it's just, dude, it becomes so hard. Is there I'm anything good there? What, what are you I on top of? I could buy a freeze ray and freeze this bitch. You can, but then, uh, like, that'll the be fine for hostage. this. It'll be fine for this level, but but later on I think it'll be really bad. Um, okay. I can buy. Uh, yeah, I don't, I don't know if there's anything good. Spectacles. Nah, those cavern. are all pretty trash. Okay, so can you can you crouch? Oh, don't. Uh, well, can Oof. you jump jump here and throw a rope with Y? Then get up there. Uh, I already used. Oh wait. Oh, there we go. Nice. You should have. You, you have four ropes. Okay. Oh, nice. Want to try and jump to my head, done. please? Oh. You died from the fall. <laughs> oh my gosh. <laughs> Still getting back into this. <laughs> I told you I was not that great. Give me the stuff. Okay. <laughs> um, so we can. Uh, we have this key, so we want to try and find the chest, but it could be kind of hard to get to. But uh, we'll, we'll, we'll sure bitch. try our best. Might be like completely on the other side of the map. What do I have? What, that was the last of my ropes. Okay, that's not great. Oh, I'm a ghost oh. now. I got you. I got you. Oh, thank you. I, did I kill him there? It's weird. Oh, I kind of want to sack your body. <laughs> what do you get if you Sa do that? The sacrificing is uh, really OP in this game. Mm. Basically, you can get this thing called the Kapala, uh, which gives you extra health as you kill enemies. Okay, actually, mm. wait. I, I, I actually am kind of screwed. I've, I can't get back up because uh, I have no ropes. Uh. Ugh, this isn't great. Get out of here. Okay, we just gotta throw a couple bombs. And I think in here... Get the Ujot Eye. If you look see, uh, carefully in the background, you see there's five uh, five people here. 
Yeah. Actually, that's actually a, a, a monument to five streamers who helped make uh, Spelunky HD very popular. Yo, this guy, this guy's a professional Spelunky player. Uh, something like that. <laughs> okay, there's a ghost. So since the ghost is already here, I can just take yep. this. Let's get out of here. All right. So we're not doing too oh. bad, actually. We got, we got the eye. We're in this level three. So this is why, like, Spelunky 2 co-op can be a lot easier. It's, it's Northern Lion, um, uh, Bear Taffy, Michael Ale Fox, like Red Panda Gaming, I think. And then there's like uh, one other that I, I can never remember. But I don't uh, I don't play this game too much, but I do follow a couple people who uh, played it qu quite religiously. Ooh. Thank you, Turkey, for saving my life. <laughs> Soon Binks will be on that monument. Yeah, one day, man. We'll see. Oh, ah, shit. What the hell, dude? <laughs> I didn't Why'd think that Why'd you do was, that? I didn't know what would happen there. Uh, oh, I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm dead. I got you. Thank you for the poofs. I will blow them. Hmm. Oh, no. I was going to try and kill that guy just as a joke. <laughs> All right. Let's, uh, let's, let's, All let's right. do it right this time. That was a warm up. 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 We're going to die a lot. This, this, this is going to happen. Just throw a bomb? Okay. Let's just no, 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 no. Like, what the fuck, dude? What are you doing? It's not a boulder. It's Maniac. A okay. And you know you can walk on these spikes, right? Oh, oh yeah. I got you. Wait, can we even get up? Oh, shit. Oh, yep. Shouldn't have done that. Okay. <laughs> now we got to rush to the end. <laughs> oh, yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The ghost, I, I the ghost pot, that, it gives, no. you, a lot of, uh, gives mm. you a lot of gold because of the diamond. But uh, it immediately spawns the ghost. All right. We're fine. Keep going, keep going. I'll, I'll distract him. Yeah. Ah. Try go in. Uh. Maybe, maybe get this dog. Yeah, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. God, please go in. <laughs> <laughs> I went to go get some more gold in the meantime. Yeah, no, I messed up. I probably yeah, should have told you. <laughs> it should make things easier. Yeah, so true, man. Don't Dang, worry, I'll save you. Someone. Oh, get that bomb box. Just get those bombs. Take kill the shopkeeper. Yo, let me kill him. Oh, there's nothing. Okay, I'm getting the web gun. Oh, no, 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 no. You don't want the web no. gun. I can freeze him and then you just have to whip him, I think. All right. Yeah, bitch. Let's go. I should be able to freeze this guy while he's in the air. Right here, come, come, come down here a little bit. Oh, and the shoddy. Here, stay. Uh, go down. Stay right there. Then yeah. I think if I freeze him in the air, he'll die. And he'll stop being annoying. Yeah, I got him. Do I have unlimited ammo with this? Yeah, yeah, you can just nice, you can just spray, dude. Spray and pray, baby. It should make things easier, but everyone just gets in the, each other's ways. Yeah, I think if you right. I think if you shoot that, I'm, I'm free. Let's go. Welcome back. Yeah, I think you one shot me with that shotgun, though. So just make sure you uh, you're not sh not shooting it when I'm around. I'll, I'll let you never. kind of lead the way. Oh, this bat. All right, get that bat, dude. Don't be afraid to sometimes. Uh, oh man, I shouldn't have just. Try kill this guy. No. Um. So there's a few things we could do. I I usually just keep the turkeys because he, he can give you like a single item if you give him all three turkeys. Ooh. You're out of your mind for doing that. <laughs> um, you're actually so crazy. Uh. Um, I think the turkeys are just really good. You can blow them up to get uh, health if we want. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Uh, eventually, so if we're running out of the health, we can do that. But also, if you just, like, ride them, you get a double jump. You get, like, a cape effect. You get hit. It just, like, tanks the hit. They're kind of OP. All right, I'll ride this guy. Yeah, you're great. Oh, wait, wait. Don't go on his, because I think he'll get really mad. Mm. Yeah, don't go on the ones that he has, because otherwise he'll uh, he'll try and kill you. And he's, he's kind of strong. Uh, but there is... I don't know if there's another one down here. Yo, get that crate. What do we got? Nice. Bombs. Dude, we're bombed out of our minds, dude. 17 bombs. Uh, I think you're going to have to use a rope to get back, so I can just, I'll just exit. 
I think. I shouldn't kill this guy? What's that? I can't get back. I'm, I'm here, I'm here. Oh, nice. Uh, no, you should not kill him. He, he's he's quite a mean person. He, like, won't spawn again? Or uh, oh, shit. No! Ah! What'd you do? I died. Oh, no. Uh, oh! He's, he's cracked. Nice. I just wanted that turkey, dude. I, I'd worked so hard to get the turkey. Uh, did we run out of time? We must have run out of time. Yeah, I think that's what happened. I, I thought you'd hit the, the ghost I didn't button. do anything. I didn't do anything. Turkey shotgun, though, dude. Turkey shotgun's hella OP. Oh, oh. He's alive. Yeah, the turkey takes the hit for you. It's kind of cracked. It's kind of kind of nuts, actually. Uh, okay, uh, so this guy's quite mad at us. Understandably. I kind of want all the stuff in your shop. All right, I got him. I'm gonna blow him. I'm gonna blow him. Yeah, freeze him. Freeze him. Yeah. Let's go. Doggo. Uh, I'm just gonna blow these up. Ghost OP. No. They're quite annoying. Yeah. Okay, <sighs> Wasting ropes. Uh, I'll try and bring both shotguns so that you can get yours. You can have one too. Uh, which is probably gonna- we're gonna kill ourselves- each other at one point. I- I- there's no doubt in my mind that that's the case. Get- get down there. So I think it's 2.30 on the clock is when, um... 2.30 on shotgun. the clock is when the- when the ghosts come. It might be faster with, uh, more people. If anyone's- if anyone's good at the game. Oh yeah, you're down there. Let's go. Three minutes? Very nice. But is there is there something about it's 2.30 in the original one I've been playing recently. Uh grab that key. Need it. But I want a shotgun. Yeah, I'll I'll, I'll keep the shotgun going out for you. Don't worry. Alright, fine. Oh uh, how did how did the how did our boy die? Uh. Okay, uh, back oh, up. Shit. I'm gonna whip this down here. Grab the other this guy one. is mad. He's, he's not very happy with us now, I, I would say. It's actually much easier for us to kill them with one of us dead, but it will be fine. But don't jump down. Okay. Yep. I just gotta hot drop him, I think. Yeah, that's all you. Wait for him to come up here. Wait for him to go past. Oh, I died. Look at that. Oh, he didn't die! Oh, he didn't die! Fuck. I was wrong! I was lying! <laughs> I got you. I got him. I'll get him. Come on, shotty snipes. Shotty Let's snipes. Go! Let's go. <laughs> oh, <no. laughs> 230 in the OG co-op has no effect on time. Thank you. Thank you. Oh. Ah! Ah! <laughs> get wrecked. Oh, shit. Nice. Good shooting. Oh, we got Binks. Ew. All right. Rip bomb and ropes. Oh, I didn't pick it up. Oh no, you, you didn't grab the package, huh? That's all, all of our items. Oh, son of a bitch. Oh my. Please don't shoot the gun while <laughs> I'm right there, dude. Freaking give me a haircut with that. I don't know. I don't Shot know the bullet right on my head. It. All right, so <sighs> we got this little piece of shit. Oh. All right. Uh. I think I you just, just go and just start blasting them. Yeah. <laughs> Close. Oh, I got him once. Let's go. Oh yeah, if you shoot him, you blow up the bomb bag. That's right. It's kind of like bad to do that. All right. I like your little fart sound that you make. <laughs> your little like squeak. That's not in the game. <laughs> it's coming out. The, is the mic that hot? It's <laughs> yeah. coming through the mic. It's all on Binks. Well, look at this, dude. We're already on the second level. On our first try. In many ways, it's our first try. When you <sighs> think about it. Son of a bitch. Let's garden it. I can freeze him. Uh, I can freeze him. 
Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So true. Yeah. Uh, I cannot get the dog though because I don't have any resources. Yeah, that's fine. I don't need a dog. We got a shotgun and a prayer. The the other problem is that if we keep doing what we're doing and just murdering every shopkeeper, we'll we'll just have to fight the shopkeepers every uh, every level from now on forever. Well, I've never even been here before. Never been to Volcano? No. Yeah, this is the, the you can go to two different paths in this game. You can go to either Volcano, which is this one. Just basically like a big old volcano area. I just gotta make sure because I can soft lock myself really easily. Wait, I can't tell if this is the way to go. I don't think I think if I went down here, I think we would just lose on the spot. Because I don't think we can keep going further. Ah! Yeah, you're here. Log. I'm back. Yep. Ah! Okay. Charge! Fine. Gotta keep my finger off the trigger. I think we just have to. We just have to. Oh, oh Jesus my God. Christ! <laughs> All right, I'm out, dude. Oh, oh, oh. God! It's <laughs> <laughs> a good run. <laughs> All right. All right. Next time. Next. Ne uh, next time. Hey, dude, that's progress right there, dude. That's the farthest you've ever made it. Lava. Uh, we don't. The chest usually isn't worth. I don't think. All right, all right. Thank you for the follow. Welcome in. Welcome, welcome. Boop this guy down. Oh, he shouldn't be. Oh, jump, jump, jump. Yep. Yeah, you can't, you can't, you can't hurt him while he's, uh, while he's stunned. Yeah, I, was, I thought, I thought I knew the perfect timing there. Um, I'll go get that crate. I will do oh, it. we gotta go to the end. We gotta go oh, to the shit. end. I messed up. Oh, <laughs> I done goofed. Oh fuck. Oh no. Bro, no. why did you stand there? You just stood I, there and took I it. I opened the menu. <laughs> you, just, uh. you just stood there, dude. All right, fuck this. Ah. Run it back. <laughs> <laughs> You're just watching, you just... <laughs> he almost got you, he's like, oh, he's fine now. It's like, no, yeah. he's not! No, he's not! So what does is, what is the dog actually do for us if we get him to the end? Uh, if you bring him to the end, he gives you one health. Mm. Okay, okay. The only, one of the only ways to get health in the game, except for the, uh, the turkeys. Oh! Oh, oh our doggo! Yeah, oh, shit. No! Oh! Nice, good whip, good whip. All right, I'll take the I'll take the urn. Urn's so scary, dude. We we. Oh, <laughs> I'm saying that we the, we uh, we should just <laughs> let's just put it down now. We, let's just not mess with the urn. I feel like the oh, urn's too oh, much of a oh, too much of a, oh. a top player. Oh no! <laughs> I need your stuff, man. I told you I'm not good at this game. Sorry. Okay. I got your stuff. It's okay. Revive him. And Easy round. Need to get this guy to come chase me so he can. Actually, I could him? probably drop through right here. I just had to not land. I would have grabbed the edge. Myself. I was fine. I did. Nice. And he hit me with the coffin piece. <laughs> oh my god, that's unfortunate. <laughs> oh, look out! Oh god. <laughs> What? There's an arrow. Don't jump. Gotta <laughs> <laughs> watch those arrow traps, man. That's fair. That's fair. Those arrow traps do two points of damage. They're, they're real. This mean. game is hard. Chat. <laughs> yeah. All right. This if anyone doesn't hard. doesn't understand, this game is on like not just hard. This game is insanely hard. Okay. Uh, we're looking for a yellow key. See yellow key? I got the key. I have oh, it. come over to me. Oh, good snag. Go right up, right up there. Grab the dang chest. Is it in there? Mm -hmm. oh. oh, also, while you're there, if you want a little treat for the chat, pick up the chest and throw it against the wall. Phew! Isn't that the, a nice the, little gong the sound? ASMR? Yeah, yeah gong, it's, it's the best sound in the game. <laughs> Shouldn't have done that. Oof. <laughs> I got you. <laughs> what? <laughs> what the fuck just happened? 
<laughs> just jumped into the shredder, dude. All right. Oh, God. I thought you were going to jump on this spike. All right. We got this. We got this. Not that bad. Takes, dude, getting getting the getting your legs in Spelunky takes a while. Yeah. Like you you jump you like the jumping is really touchy. It's not like any other game, pretty much. Everything try everything's trying to kill you. Okay, hold up, hold up, hold up. Yeah, we gotta use a rope for that for sure. Uh no no no, you can just uh if you just drop your oh to get the cat. To get both of them, maybe. I don't know. Yeah, well if you if you drop the rope and then just whip it. If you hit down whip the cat down well hold down, hold down and hit X. And then hit X again to whip it, and then you'll trigger that arrow trap. Nice. It's really important to, to make sure those arrow traps hit. Oh, we'll burn a rope. Piece Oops. of shit. <laughs> <laughs> okay, it's okay. Actually, didn't it, the 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 whip only stuns. It doesn't actually do damage to me. Oh fuck. It's okay. It's a good weapon. Should I? I, I don't know if I should take this urn. Uh, no, well, let's just let's just say let's just not mess with the urns anymore because it's never been a net positive for us I think every time we've got an urn we've either had to skip to, to the end of the level. Oh no! <laughs> it's all right. It's all right. All right Well, just the cost of doing business, baby uh, <laughs> I'm trapped uh, If you push that block You can uh, push it left you should uh -huh. be able to get up without using a rope. Just don't push it all the way in. You. I got your stuff. Nice. What the? Look at his rock. He's so proud <laughs> of it. So cute. Uh, don't, don't, don't kill him! He, oh, he, just, he just wanted to hang out with his rock! <laughs> he used to stomp on his head. Wait, wait, let him pick up the rock again. Do some push-ups first. A couple push-ups. Oh, there you go, buddy. Okay. All right. All, right. <laughs> All is good. All is good. All is good in the world. He's <laughs> just, just vibing over there. And you just freaking. Is that worth a rope? No, oh, nice. definitely not. I don't think money ever is really. Oh. Yeah, those 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 pillows. Even though they're just pillows, they they still little. Still hit you. Uh, that's probably worth a bomb, though. Yeah. I think crates are usually worth a bomb. Nice. One bomb for three. Look at that. Bitch, bitch, bitch. Art of the deal, baby. One one for three. All right, let me... I can get him out of here. Thank you. Binks is back. Let's go. All right. Uh, sacrifice me. Really? Yeah. Oh, <laughs> no, what the, f the hell, how man? Did that, how did that backfire? <laughs> God damn. Hey, you want to sacrifice as much as you can usually when you get these things. And if they're alive, you get extra points. So that's what I was going to tell you to sacrifice me. Because you could have done it while I was alive. Yeah, you, just have to hold, you have to hold down an X. Yeah. So what does this do? Uh, so you keep getting what's called uh, favor for uh, that girl. She's like an evil demon god. Her name's Kali, I believe. Mm. Uh, I don't know if we're gonna get this. I might as well give, give my chat the bell. Nice. <laughs> you look so much happier playing this than you do snap. <laughs> I don't know if that's a good thing or a bad thing, man. I think it's just the spice of life, you know? Variety is fun. Why we do it? Even if you love something, Chad, after you play it so much, like, it's really nice to switch it up to something else. Mm hmm. Doing over here. Just vibing? Just exploring? Just doing a little explore over there by yourself? Me. Little dung beetles. But yeah, we're not going all the way back up with the key. We'll just deal with it. Okay. Let's yeah, no, go. no, it is it is uh it is 230. You lied to me. You lied to me, Benno.
I thought I thought that was the case that it uh, that it goes early uh, based on how I think it's 30 seconds less for every player. Uh, why did you shoot that? me? Yeah, why did you, what just happened there? Why wait? Why did you shoot me? Did, it was a, was it because of me? I just I just did my. Uh, did like you did, ice? Did you ice something? No, I just used my. I, I pressed the. Uh, it says you. Someone said you stole by accident. But I hit. I thought if you hit. I thought right trigger is how you pick it up. Oh, maybe I hit. I hit right trigger on the cape, and then it picked it up, and then he thought I was stealing the cape. I did, I did not accident. blow an item, guys. I did not. Sounds like something. Uh, wasn't me. It wasn't Blue me. An island would say. Oh, no, uh, no, okay, no, no. wait, wait. While you're out there, oh, son of a bitch. Um, <laughs> wait, we should be fine. Cause this it. should hit this guy. No, no, just don't go down. Don't go down. Okay. Nice. We just had to. We just had to. That, that that triggered. Sorry. Ah! Stop <laughs> <hanging>. <laughs> nice. Look at those whips, dude. Dude, getting used to the whip timing is so hard too, because it's like it's like you like lumber it. Yeah, and it goes both ways too. You assume this deck would have Maria Hill? If I could put Maria Hill in my Spelunky deck, I would do oh, it. Oh yeah. Oh. oh. Bitch. Damn, that bat wrecked you. Ugh. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> uh, oh, a hot little just, jump thing. Yeah, just grab, grab, make sure you grab my stuff. Yeah. You can bring me with. <laughs> I don't think it likes you. <laughs> I tried. <laughs> There's like some some things that are like too too bulky that like it doesn't let you carry through doors. You're just too thick. Pink's was very tilted because of sandbar. Yeah, like, location suck ass, dude. What do you think about sandbar? Me? Yeah. What's, what, oh, the new location. Yeah. Um, I actually just posted a deck on Twitter, uh, an anti-patriot deck. What did you and, play? No, that was Sauron? pretty fun. I played. Uh, no, no, no. I was just. Uh, it was like everything the counters patriot, like enchantress, uh, rogue stuff like that. And mm -hmm. then I play Hulk at the top end to play on the sandbar, and it's so epic. It, it oh actually, yeah, that's like, pretty cool. Time. Yeah. I, I was actually winning, like, there was one point, like, I, I must have played, like, 25 games or something and lost, like, two or something. I don't know. It was, like, just heaps and heaps of very well. Yeah, that's, uh, that's... yeah. Uh, here. Uh, use patriot. this turkey and get up there and then uh, throw a bomb on top of that and grab the crate. Use the, do the what on the what? Uh, you can throw, throw a bomb oh, on oh. top, on top of there. Then you can jump in there and grab it, grab it, whatever's in the crate. Bonk him. Nice. <laughs> That's shabby. And I don't think we need anything from there. I'm gonna break our main rule. Okay. We're at the end though, right? I know. Aye. Shush. <laughs> Look at that, the turkey turkey tanked all the damage for you, man. I thought I took Patrick, a Tired Tired Patriot is the deck I played last season. Yeah, I can feel that. Which I called me a turkey. Oh, this, should I get this gold thing? Yeah, yeah, grab, uh, well here, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. Uh... <laughs> 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 I, I think, I forgot, I have to jump inside and then push it out, but then I just Even can't. I knew that was gonna happen, bro. Yeah, uh, but I, uh, I got it, you know. I thought <laughs> it was going to be fast enough. I just thought it would be, like, way faster, you know? You ever feel like you're just going to do something way better than you actually do it in practice? All the time. All the time, so true. <laughs> bonk. Okay. Uh, all you had to do was bonk once. Is that arrow pointing to you? What? Yeah. Oi! Yo, this guy is a bitch. I can't even get up. I'm yeah, those, guys are, those guys are pretty rude, man. Yo, it's Stegron. Yeah, dude, that is kind of Stegron-esque, right? What the hell? All right, hardest jump in the game. You got it, though. What? Hey, wait, have you ever speed run a game? Uh, I have not. No. 
Not really into speed running too much. The only game I've ever done it with is uh, Mario 64. Quite fun though. Yeah, that is that is the game for that. Uh, yeah, just. Actually, like, uh, I feel like it's uh, the reason it's the game is because it's like there's so many people who do it. and It's a very cool speed run, but it's also incredibly like approachable. I've only guess. done maybe I've only done maybe 20 ones runs ever, but I can beat the game in like uh, under a half hour. Damn. It's, like, I mean, it's you can pretty also quickly get like OK. Uh, at it. Yeah, I mean, it's also just like probably very nostalgic for a lot of people. Oh yeah, I mean it's just uh, it was like the the first platform, right? All right, let's not let's not go through because the crate's very important. Ugh. Probably not worth uh, taking a death. But right here, I'll just pop the crate and then. Um... Oh no! Don't go down! Don't go down! Don't go down! Uh, just just leave. Because otherwise we have to w waste resources to get out. You're good. I'm good. Totally. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Let's go. Yeah, and we both stayed alive. Save... Yeah, dude, world's first. Sick. When we when we save it, we, I think we actually both get um, actually both get health. I don't even know what you saved. Uh, the the little cat or like the dog. Sometimes oh, it's the dog, sometimes it's a cat, sometimes it's a hamster. I think. R64 speedrun is probably the easiest to speedrun because it's one of the most speed ran. Therefore, having tutorials which make it approachable to new runners. Um, I think that's true to an extent, but I also think that um, j just the fact that it's uh, like learning how to do it in an okay fashion, the te the the like crazy tech is quite it's easy home. too, which is which is pretty important. Uh, but that's definitely a factor for sure. Okay, what are we buying here? Uh, do you want the spike shoes? Make sure it jumps really strong. Uh. I'll grab the bombs. I don't want the machete. The machete That's the worst ass. thing ever. Yeah. Yeah. Which one do you uh, want? Do you want bombs or do you want spikes? Take the pick. spikes, sure. Right. So now I. What what does that do? Uh, it just means your stomps are retarded. Like go stomp on that lizard right now. I'm scared. There. Uh, I think you can one shot him. Fuck. Die. That was like an impossible drop. Yeah, I did. I did. Ah! All right, uh, don't go through <laughs> yet. Okay, wait. I can, I'll actually do this properly. Oh, and we get a. Watch out! There's a spider coming. Just try not to make make sure you don't hit the uh, bong for chat. That's for you, chat. Even get two of them. Get that. Should I use a rope for the doggo? Uh, yeah, definitely. And then. Uh, and there's an urn up here too. Uh. Yeah, throw the throw the yeah, dog gonna... down. Oh shit. Uh, we're fine. We're fine. Get the dog. Yeah, we're good. Yeah. I should have told you I was. Let's doing go. That. <laughs> I definitely should have told you I was grabbing that. Uh, <laughs> no, you're good, you're good. That thing. <laughs> nice. We got a good amount of money. What are we on? World four or Killing level it. four? Level three. Let's say you hear the beating of drums. All right, one three. Okay, nice. We both have turkeys too. Look at this. Hell yes. You can stop that guy. Yep. Ah, that's fine. I will tame you. You're mine. No, I love turkey. Happy Thanksgiving. Oh shit. No, no, don't die, turkey. Peace. Okay. Right, I found the yeah. exit already. Yeah. Oh, my turkey dead. Turkey's dead. Uh, if you have a spare bomb, you can blow him up for a health. Deal. Nope, I don't have one. Uh, you have two. Wait, but... Yes, I do. Yes, I do. Yeah. Let me know when you want me to go through the through the wall. Oh, I found a secret cave. Pop. Yo, oh. hey, that's me. What is happening here? <laughs> I'm just killing this guy. Oh, you Oops. took a hit from him for no reason. <laughs> he was Oops. stuck in the spider web. Alright, 4-4, four, four, baby. Thanksgiving is ruined. Let's go.
Look at this, dude. We're schmoving a little bit now. I'm gonna save my hands. A little here. mouse. Let us cook, chat. Let us cook. All right, cool, cool, cool. Uh, if you want to stop this lizard once he moves to the left a little bit. Bang. One shot him. Uh, so this this little fucking pine cone piece of garbage. Yeah, same, same thing with this dude. It's a little bit annoying. So here, I, I I can I can try and take him. I kind of just want to throw like a bunch of stuff at him. What if I stomp on him? Uh, I don't think it works. Maybe it works. Do you have spike shoes? Give it a try and then just get ready to jump back on the ladder. Oh, it does work. Yeah, see. It's, it... <laughs> I didn't know I would only bounce that much. Nice. Use me. Oh. Oh, maybe I should try freezing him. Oh, oh. what? <laughs> Yeah, freezing is definitely the move. He, he yeah. like, he fucking jumped, dude. He's a cheater. Yeah, that guy's a cheater, but. Nice, good, good pound. That was a good run, though. That was a good run. That was a good run, dude. We we made some made some not not full progress, but like tiny progress. Yeah. There is a saying in Splunky that says ABC, always be carrying. It's always have something to carry. Uh, yeah. Have you, you You mean you have me to carry you? Ooh. <laughs> uh, it's going to get a little funky. I don't think this has been triggered. Oh, no, it has been triggered. Damn. <laughs> move along. Yeah, we're good. We're good. It wasn't all that bad. Two, two health? Not, not too shabby. Get any of this? Maybe if we find some extra gold. Okay, actually the spike shoes are pretty good. I'll stay. I'll stay back. If you want to go ahead and try and find some more gold, so I can grab right. the spikes. And I'll let my chat listen to the sweet music. Shit. All right, I'm done. <laughs> Alrighty then. That was unfortunate. Yeah, you know, that was. It's a weird glitch that just happened. You didn't see it. Fucking cheaters, dude. Uh, Damn cheater bot strike again. Fuck. Spike shoes aren't that important. I was lying. It's fine. They're overrated. Yeah, spike shoes are overrated. So true. And based. Uh. No! My Damn. Okay, he's fine. You can take a hit. Ugh. Oh shit. Okay. Um, I got you when he comes out. Nope, oh, missed. Going for that mold, dude. I don't respect it. Yo, sweet, free turkey. Nice. All right, not too shabby. We, we got through it. This game looks this. happy. I mean, it depends on what you mean by happy. It is uh, uh. <laughs> it's it's definitely like a uh, looks are deceiving. It's, it's a very hardcore <laughs> game. What the heck is that guy? He's just a dude. He's bald. Thank you, turkey. Damn. Hey, Damn, who are you, me? Just keep getting oh. hit, dude. No. Turkey's dead. Oh. Oh, no. All right, I'm trying to freeze. I'm trying to freeze him. I know where he is. Oh, I'm going to freeze myself. Nice. <laughs> oh, shh. I'm dead. Kill him! Oh! <laughs> he whooped your ass, dude. Uh, oh. The art style makes it look fun and happy. Yeah, I would say so. But it's a cool, like, kind of cartoony, cutesy. That's cutie, my bad. <laughs> <laughs> you said always hold hey, come, something. Come here, can you stand next to me? When I always hold something, I want to. Yeah, I'll die. I'll die. 
Hey, can you stand right here for a second? <laughs> can you hold this bomb for a second? <laughs> Just eat a rock across <laughs> the map right at me. All right, so... <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Was... <laughs> <laughs> so when when you're up, when when there's like weird things like that with the arrow traps, learning where learning to spot arrow traps ahead of time are, is probably the most yeah. important thing. Looking about ahead this game. is probably important. Yeah. It's a, it's a shit. <laughs> All right, I got. Wait for him to turn his back and then I'll get him. It's shit. Nice. All right. All right, I'm looking this time. There's nothing. Nice. Nice. We did it. Look at this girl. Look at this well oiled machine. All right, let's see. Watch this. Oh. Good, good work. oh. Uh, didn't proc that. Didn't proc that. I did not proc that. That's fine, though. Uh, here, I'll grab this guy and we can proc it. Uh, I think we can get around this anyway. Uh, no, I would not try it. I, you might die. You, It might work, but it's not working. Uh, that was unfortunate. <laughs> Hammer's ready, prepare to flash. Oh, doggo uh, pigs! Oh, oh good boy. <laughs> oh, you're so sleepy. Oh, look at this sleepy <laughs> dog. Uh -huh. Adorable. All right, all part of the plan. All part of the plan. Yeah, I trust you, Binks. I trust you. Easy. Easy wins. Nice. <laughs> he got around. He did get around it, dude. It's very true. When when both of those players die, it restarts, yeah. Is this this is active, right? Wait, wait, here. Yeah. Look at this. <laughs> <laughs> nice. I could have turned you into an ice block, maybe. And then you I, <laughs> I thought I, I thought it would have gone gone past me. <laughs> Uh, I don't think I can buy any of those. I don't think any of them are very good anyway. The shotgun's like okay to buy sometimes. Oh, it's a poison guy! Let's go. Oh, I nope. missed you there. Ah, it's a friggin' mole! Maybe we can go. Next time we get through 4-4, uh, four, four, we'll go through the jungle. We have a choice? Yeah, there's two different ways that you can go. Mm. Oh, Want to be turkey turkey friends with me? How did that not trigger? I must have already triggered, huh? Turkey boys! Let's go, turkey boys! Let's go. It's Thanksgiving somewhere. This is a roguelite? It is indeed a roguelite. Yeah, so if people don't know, roguelite basically, you start from the beginning over and over and over again, and then you slowly get better at the game. Every single map is procedurally generated. So they, there's the different map, a different thing every time, but there's like a general flow of different uh, locations and stuff that we'll go through uh, over the course of this. Woo! Sorry. <laughs> okay, so what happens heard, if we give him turkey? Hmm, do we want to give it to him? Uh, we can try that. Let's see. Let's make sure we can find the third one first. Uh, just don't jump. Just yeah. don't jump because the almost a. Uh, yeah. We find someone else to throw. Can you look up and see if there's a turkey up there? Oh, there's actually multiple crates. Uh, here. I see a hamster. I want that too. I'll take the bullet. Can we I only need two. Oh, we only need two. Yes. Yeah, so let's get the turkeys. Thank you. Let's go. And now we get to keep it, right? Or no? Uh, no, don't take it. He will kill you. <laughs> yeah, it nice. just gives us like, just gives us like some gold. It's usually not worth it, in my opinion. I think the turkeys are kind of OP. But uh, yeah, he will kill you if you try and take the turkeys. In the grand scheme of things, you know, it's kind of whatever. 
right, what are we doing resources wise? All right, we're back to world four. We have 24K gold, that's pretty good. I'm a little low on health, but resources are fine. Just make sure you don't get yourself in too much of a pickle because you don't have any ropes. That's, that a, that's a bit spooky. Uh, hang on. Ah! Nice. Hear the drums. Oh! Are you fighting Porcupine Man? I'm good, I'm good, I'm good. Don't fight Porcupine Man, dude. He's very scary. Uh, I don't like this. Ah, and neither of us have shoes. Alright, alright. I'm gonna try and. Alright, don't. Bitch, dude. I don't. There's some way to like get him to chase you, but I don't know. So if you go straight down, stare at him. Oh, the jump, jump, climb. Then let him go. Nice. Then you can have him chase you back this way. Oh shit! Come you have here, to. Bitch. It's gonna go further. Or you can just use a bomb. I would just use a bomb to go through that. Uh, no, on the left. Yeah. Uh, he's gonna kill you. Ah. Uh -huh. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you're uh, you're a bit fucked. Ah, all right, all right. Uh, are you asking what game it is and what platforms? Uh, no, it's not a uh, hashtag ad. It's just a very good. <laughs> That's unfortunate. Oops. Yeah. Uh, it's available <laughs> on all platforms. It's called Splunky Two. Uh, <sighs> but no, I, I'm not. Uh, we're, we're not sponsored to play this game. Not sponsored. It's just. But if they uh, want to sponsor really us, hey. I'm I'm keen, man. Have you done any uh, sponsor streams recently? Uh, I have. I just did a Shattered Heaven. Oh, what is that? It's a, it's a deck building roguelike game. Oh, Pong. Pretty nice, yeah. <clears throat> That's about it, though. Wait, is that the one that Regis did, too? Uh, I know Dexter did it. Mm. So it's quite possible. Yeah, the hour. I wanted to play for more than an hour. I didn't really get to do too much. So. I said a hero, hero wars one. Uh, I think I've done that too. Oh, for sure, for sure. Um, uh, you want to go grab the um? Yeah. There's a, there's a doggo. We get our health going. That porcupine thing is so freaking hard, dude. I think like once you get the strategy, that thing just hit me. Oh, I guess it didn't hit me at all. No? Didn't take any damage. I should I get some weapons for him. Yeah, I think you're, you. There, there's some way to get him to like jump, run at you properly. But I'm oh, really bad at no. it. Oh, poor turkey. I'm he sorry. did it. He did his job, right? He took like five hits for me. <laughs> can't, can't really ask for much more than that. Let me uh, to arrow trap. Uh, this is gonna suck. Oh yeah. I, yeah, I'll just run right. Um, let me try and get this dude with an arrow. Yeah. Nice mm -hmm. shot. Okay. Let's go. Uh, you can stand right next to him. He'll jump over you, and then you run away to trigger the big jump plus roll. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Okay, so get him to jump over me. Really far, and then big jump plus roll. But I want to kill him. Oh, after you do that, once he rolls past you, you can throw a bomb after him, and then it'll get him. It'll be a turkey boy again. Oh, turkey boys! There's another turkey. Also, when you when you have the turkeys, you can hold A, and he flaps its wings, and he, and he, he goes slow, mm. like the cape. Yo, we got some sick stuff over here. Ivan's clothing shop. You want any of this? You want big jumps or the 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 climbing gloves are pretty good? That you climb up walls. What do the spectacles Great. do? Uh, they're not that good. They let you see into walls and stuff. But uh, we're probably gonna get the Ujot Eye, which does the same thing. I'll do some. I'll do some uh, spring shoes actually. Yeah, the spring shoes are pretty nice. They let you jump like a whole square higher. Uh, yeah, we're not giving him these turkeys, dude. No! 
Oh. All right. Okay. Not too All bad. Right. Not too bad. One three. Uh, uh, Th thank you for that, by the way, Benel. 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 Damn, that's unlucky. Yo, dude, spring shoes, boys. Another. A. Hey. You wanna jump with me? Let's go, chat. I got your turkey. <laughs> I wanted him the whole time anyway. Damn. Rex. <laughs> A dog on a turkey. Feeling Everyone good. knows turkey is the worst part of Thanksgiving anyway. True. Kind of a trash bird in many ways. So if you hold A while you're in the air, you can do that. It's really oh, nice, nice to hot drop on people. Yeah. Ah, oh, fuck me. Ooh, ooh. Um, make sure go to the right, go to the right. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, no! Uh, <laughs> huh. Oh, that guy had a gun? Oh, no, that's an arrow. Uh, actually, let, let me let the dog go free. Oh, I don't have any more ropes. I have rope, I think. Which let me one see am I? I, On the I might be able to get it just like this. I, th I think I should be able to get it with the turkey. Okay. Cool. Nice. Uh, oh, yeah, and then, and then it's right there. Nice, nice time. Yeah, so we'll get the Ujot Eye, which does the same thing as the spectacle, so it's usually not worth By the way, chat, ASMR for you. Just for, you. Just for you, chat. <laughs> Just beating the shit out of that guy. <laughs> I'm fucking him with my cock. <laughs> <laughs> All right, dude, we're doing we're doing really good right now. We both have. Uh... All right, let's go. <laughs> okay, we just have to knock it soloed by this uh, this guy. Okay, let's see. Mm. It's soloed by Porcupine Man uh, for the third time. Um. I don't know what to do about that guy. I don't like him. I don't like the look of him. All right, we have we have more we have more skills now. Thanksgiving sides are always the best part. Yeah. Uh, what, what are your favorite Thanksgiving things? I would say like stuffing Dirt, might be uh, my favorite. Stuffing, stuffing, stuffing is the nuts. It's like stuffing's like you oh. don't you don't. I've I've never had stuffing in a not Thanksgiving meal. I don't know why. Yeah, that's true. But mashed potatoes are probably number two. Or like a good casserole. I don't really like green bean casserole. Uh it's just it's just stuffing for me. That's that's the goat. Um okay. if you if you mix like stuffing, if you mix one thing that my mom does is uh mm -hmm. she puts stuffing, mashed potatoes, and the turkey together. For oh. like an for like a leftover turkey meal, and it is so freaking good. You said stuffing, potatoes, and, and gravy? And turkey? Uh, no, no, stuffing, stuffing, mashed potatoes, and turkey. All right, and we're gonna we're gonna use the the trigger. Are you gonna move over? Ah! Okay, this is actually a lot easier with the turkey. We should be fine. All right, I would get get the hell out of here. Get the hell out of here, dude. It just. just... <laughs> I got this, man. Okay, ah! Oh, no, no, my turkey! Oh. <laughs> you will live forever, my son. Why did he die over here? Oh, I died. Oh, the big guy's dead? Yeah, the big guy died. I don't know, he must have hit like a TNT block or something? I actually have no idea. Why Why would you do that? My bad. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were gonna move. Thought I was gonna you move, can take he my says. Turn. No, you're fine, you're fine. Can I go in here? Uh, we can, but also he just he just bore a hole all the way to the bottom, so I don't really need to. Make sure you bring your turkey, though. Oh, man. Oh! Uh, fine, I'm fine. Uh, do you want to go over there? Cause you have a turkey. You can take the take the hit for you. I don't know how to get in there without taking a hit. I'm being real. I have a I have a rock. Oh. If you're crouched, it wouldn't let you. Oh. Yeah, I would just I would just go on the turkey, and then it'll, the turkey will take the hit, and you can kill him. Oh, you got oh, he's cracked. Okay, wow. yeah. Now, now just go up there and grab the grab the doggo. I got you, doggo. Let's get out of here. This is, uh, well, now we'll go to the jungle. The jungle, honestly, might be the hardest thing. All right, I love the sound of that. I not recommend turkey against Quebec. I've, the turkey felt really good though because you can just you double can take jump turkey. over. You can take it. Oh my God, I hate the sound of bugs. Ah. Mosquito. 
Did I even get hit by that? Yeah, I think I got um, I don't think we can use a bomb for health. Oh, Turkey's dead. Yeah, Turkey died. Should I blow him up? Uh, no, I don't think we can sack. We only have three bombs left between us. Okay, that, that man trap thing, right? That red thing? Don't yeah. jump on its head, it'll kill you. Uh, just don't okay. go near it, it'll, it'll one-shot you. Uh, this thing too. Yep. I, uh, <laughs> was trying to... <laughs> can, can, can you hit me with a, a hot freeze on this guy? Oh yeah, I got you. I was trying, I was trying to like hold on to the rope and I it did not work. Yeah. Huh. Okay, sweet. Uh, I don't need your shoes because I already have shoes. Uh, so these, yeah, th these vines will hurt. Everything hurts you here, basically. We do have shoes, so you can walk on the vines. I used uh, to have shoes, yeah. Yeah, you don't have shoes anymore. That's a good point. Uh, I do kind of want paste. Yeah, freeze him. Nah, I'll just Thanks. let him die. These little things, uh, actually don't and know how I'm going to get up, up, up through here now. We're fine. So we have the Ujot eye, so we might hear clicking at some point. When we hear clicking, we have to um, find a secret entrance to what's called the black market. Uh, can you freeze this guy? I kind of want his boomerang. Mm -hmm. uh, trees you can climb. Like you can grab onto the side of them. Ooh, if I still have your body, I could go over there. We did shatter all the other bodies, so I can just move on. Just getting through here would be great. Just, just getting through. We don't we don't have to worry about min maxing here. Like the first level, we kind of want to min max to make sure you get enough gold and everything. But uh, I think on this level, we just want to try and find the exit. I'm just vibe. Let me check in here. Whoa. Kid of the child of the forest. Welcome, dude. There's something <laughs> that he he comes back later, I think, and will help me if I if we save him. There's like cool little quests and stuff like throughout the throughout the, yep. the games. Yo, let's go. I'm back. All right, yeah. Let's just make sure we're not we're not stacking on top of each other because like any hit could just like very easily kill you in this. I right, I'm back up. Just kind of gonna boom. I'm gonna be boomerang. I mean, I don't. I just I don't know what to. <laughs> I was gonna just jump. It looked like you wanted me to jump on him. So was was it was it the fact that I said, "Can you back up? I'm gonna be boomerang." That, that bug was that made right you, below me. Made it you was, think I of, had to jump on it. I had to. <laughs> I'm better as a ghost anyway. You, you got you got the moves as a ghost. Oh no, too hot, too light. Okay, You're fine. Damn, that's so shredded him. The boomerang's really good. I really like the boomerang. Can you get rid of this mesquite? Mesquite? It's very annoying. Got the dodges. He's got the dodges. <laughs> dude, he's schmoving on you. Oh my god. He's schmoving wow. on your ass, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> this, I think the spike blocked it. This bitch. get out of here all right level three uh we could get that actually can i blow it yeah just blow it left a bunch Ooh. OP. yeah just keep oh wait wait uh oh no perfect um this is a bit annoying but look at that let's go super op thank you Way for the follow welcome in welcome welcome <laughs> it's always so funny when i'm doing variety and people follow me like I, I never, I, I'm, not, I'm not actually looking at my screen, so I don't know who's following me. I do know that they are, and I do appreciate you. And then you'll come back later and be like, why does this guy only play this weird children's card game? Mm. Good point. Good point. I appreciate you being here. Hope you're having a good time watching two people who are bad at Spelunky play Spelunky. Uh, I think we need, oh, do we only have three bombs? Yeah, I think it's still worth it. All right, back up. I'm bombing. Oh! Uh, do you want to grab him, or do you want to use the boomerang? Do you want to use the boomerang? Boomerang's really fun. Sure. 
Oh, he's comes back to you. Uh, just watch out so I can step on, like, do you see those little tiny spikes? Yeah. Uh, those will hurt you if you step on them because you don't yep. have shoes. I got, I got shoe privilege. But I guess you're barefoot if you don't have shoes on is the, is the thing, I guess. Okay, we got, uh, we got problems. I think, I am electing we should just bomb through here and just not deal with that because I, we're going to die <sighs> if we try and fight those guys. One of them just died. Uh, yeah, that doesn't look uh, good. Yeah, we can just go straight through this way and just uh, basically make it out for free. Just don't drop straight down because uh, those spike traps are very scary. And then I'll just need you to boomerang that dude. You can't you can't hurt them when they're uh, yeah. injured with the boomerang, which is cool. Uh, nice. Let's do it, dude. All right. Two four, oh. baby. Oh. I think this is the run, guys. We're about to beat it. About to beat the game. Oh, dude, look out, look out, look out. Get the fuck away from that guy. Oh, oh no, shit. you're cursed. Okay. Oh, no. Uh, kind of a nightmare situation. Now you have one health and you can't get any more health. Oh, that's uh, fine. But definitely hit that guy because he also can do chants and shit. I would just stomp on him once he once he's awake. Yeah. One of the most annoying enemies in the whole game, for sure. Oh, uh, but yeah, now you're in glass cannon mode, so you, uh, you can't take a single other hit otherwise you die. <laughs> that was kind of sick with it. <laughs> Uh, just watch your feet there. Oh! Wait, we gotta go straight to the end of the level. Alright, uh, back up. This is our last bomb, too. This is crazy. Go well, all the way the to the noise. right. That's the noise. That's the noise. Yeah. No! Okay, oh. sweet. Uh, just watch out. Try not to attack anything in here, because if you hit a shotkeeper, we're, we're, we'll just 100% die. Okay. Like, immediately. I'm a very passive player, Binks. Yeah. Welcome to the black market. Kind of a banger soundtrack. Okay. Uh, we have 41k. I think we should get bombs. We can try and get enough to get an extra life, but I don't think it's worth it because we're in co-op. We get extra life kind of for free. Oh, I need to make sure I get this. Those little spikes are really hard to see sometimes. They, they ah. are, dude. The little spikes get you. The, 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 the jungle is much harder than the other one. Or it's actually by the hedget here. You don't buy the onk. We can get the onk, though. Uh, we don't need the crown. That's just way too expensive. We're not going to try and go through the alt path. No, Binks knows I died. He just, he's just used to it. <laughs> no, I, I stared at him. Don't worry. Let's just get all the bombs we can. Uh, probably want some ropes, too. Can you uh, steal from the shop? Uh, I think so. We can, but then there's a, a, a wall of these dudes who will try and kill us. Oh. Okay. Um, man, actually really garbage shop if I'm being straight straight up with you. Yeah, a lot of rope. More rope. I'll get spikes. I guess I'll get a cape. Uh, but we should be right at the end, dude, uh, which is sick. So that this means that we'll be able to get to the last level. Unfortunately, I think I have to fight him on my own and that you won't get a uh, thing. But I can't counter chickens before they hatch, right? I'll be the best ghost you've ever seen. Uh, if you can freeze my mans. Yep. Exhibit A. Uh, yeah, let me grab the shield. I don't know really what it does, but... D Monksy, D Binksy, Variety R. Okay, so this is this oh is the, the boss of the first first game. His name is Olmec. I've never been to a boss fight ever in any of these games. <laughs> oh my gosh. Okay. I don't know if I can freeze him. You you cannot. He literally almost killed you. You've got this, Binks, you've got okay. this. So there's a few things that we can do to deal with this dude. This right off the bat. Oh, thank you, thank you so much. She gave me a little little rope because I helped her. Nice, oh, homie. Uh, exactly okay. what we needed. I, I think I know how to kill this guy. It'll take a little bit. There's a few different phases. All right, let's see it. So we can kind of just like do this. See, eventually it's gonna fall through. Yeah. There's like three different phases that we can go through. So we can just immediately stop or we can you can try and go all the way to the end and then we get an extra life. 
called the Ankh. This is usually usually pretty easy fight. This first part. And then it gets a little funky. Then he turns into like a uh, freaking spaceship. It's Modok. It it is Modok S <laughs> for sure. I don't really know how to fight him, so I kind of want to just I kind of just want to move forward. <laughs> we'll just kind of move on with our lives. All right, dude, look at this! World 3! Achievement. Let's go. So there's two different things you can do with World 3. We could go where we just went. We can go one level lower and then do the temple, which was the fourth level in the original Skulky, uh, which is probably the hardest thing in this game. Uh, but Tide Pool isn't too bad. It's pretty fun. Uh, those red things are, are just like the spikes in like the yeah. earlier parts. Wait, I, I have a cape. I can just do this. Aha. Nice. Mmm. Okay. Two life. Great. I'm trying to find your body. I do not see it. Damn! No! Oh, I didn't hit A. I, I jumped oh. and held A and I thought my cape would go off, but I have to hit A a second time. That's alright, dude. Huge prog you. Yeah. Huge prog you. Let's go, let's go. Personal best. We can get to like the ice caves, dude. Oh, baby. That cat actually sounds just like one of my cats. Yeah. Uh, we, yeah we'd have to cook a bomb. T you want, I'm yeah, gonna try and cool. cook a bomb. Oh, fuck it. oh, he's cracked, but I did kill the cat, so it was all for naught. Did look kind of cool though. Did look kind of cool. We're all about progress here, you know? One step at a time. Little progress here, little progress there. Little progress everywhere. Nice. Fish moving. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Bang. The one other thing with ah. the whip too is like the back part of it like yeah. comes out first and it goes like high and behind your head. Oh! <laughs> <laughs> wait, now I can't, wait, now I'm stuck. That's true, but it was still fun. <laughs> it was I got great. great. It was great, no. You're all good. <laughs> <laughs> the poor caveman, dude. He's just trying to enjoy his life. Oh, nice. Drive-by action? Uh, how's B-Money Variety Hour going? Uh, yeah, because, uh, D-Money, uh, what, tell me about this, actually, I, 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 I was thinking about asking about this. Tell me about this One Piece card game you've been playing. Oh, man. I love it. It's, uh, yeah, that's, that's what I've been doing IRL. That's the, uh, it's a physical card game. And they, they have an online, uh, online community made sim, which is actually pretty good. So that's what I've been... That's why I've been streaming a bit, and I'm actually making, uh, actually planning on starting a YouTube channel for that, uh, that game. Because I love it so much. Yeah. It's actually a really good card game. That's fine. Are you into One Piece? Uh, no. My friend did yeah. watch all 1,000 episodes in, like, six months, though, like a maniac. Yeah. Did I just get shot with an arrow? Did you get shot with an arrow? I think that absorbed your hit. Or maybe I got shot? I don't know. I only have one heart, somehow, so... Um, I'm not really like I haven't I've only watched 12 episodes of the show um, But like, <laughs> the card like game the, the card game is like really good and uh, there's nothing like, nothing like a physical card game I don't know Just holding the cards in your hand just shuffling them. You know? I haven't played a physical card game since I was like a Literal like child. But I do play I do play magic every once in a while with like my friends I, I've yeah. never collect magic cards. I don't think or be interested in constructive but like draft mode and stuff is very fun as long as you know the basics it yeah, have you done like a cube draft? Uh, I have done one cube draft and then we've done pack drafts a couple of times. Yeah, that's fun. I've, I've done some, uh, I've done some pre-release tournaments for Magic, actually. And pre-release is like the most fun tournament, I'd say. Everybody like busting a bunch of, like, open- cool new cards and stuff? Yo, yeah, everybody busting open packs from the new set and then making a deck with, with what you pull. 
Our Hickey, thank you so much for the raid of 57. Let's go. I am uh, currently not playing Marvel Snap, but me and D-Money are doing, we do, we've been trying to do a weekly variety couple of hours. And this is our third one, and we're playing some Spelunky 2 together. Hello. the store. Ooh, hello. Bomb back? We have so much money. Yeah. Uh, let's see. Let me grab the bombs, because I'm missing one. You can grab the paste. This gives you, gives you sticky bombs. And then you can grab the ropes, too. Oh, we should have went back for the key, but uh, it's a good throw. I have the key. Nothing else. Yeah, but we should have used it, because there was a chest. Oh. Yeah. First Blunky was awesome. Do you like the second one? I do, yeah. I've been playing the first one a little bit on my PS5 because it was like $2 on sale recently. Uh, so I've been playing on PS5 quite a bit. A toy key. I actually almost had a win on the, the Spelunky one out of nowhere. I'd never gotten to uh, the ice caves ever in like all my runs. And then just out of nowhere, I got a run that went all the way to the very end. I got to Olmec. I built a hole all the way down for Olmec, and then I just I just screwed the pooch and I panicked. And uh, I died. I died in the lava, and then Olmec followed me into the lava. Old McDonald? Old Mac, Old McDonald. Oh no, what happened? I don't know, I'll kill him. Let's go. <laughs> what is this crossbow? Hell yeah. I'm so bad at that, dude. I'll like whip and then I'll run into them before the whip comes out. It's like my worst Spelunky habit by, by a Ooh, lot. Ooh, that's kind of... It's a cool shot. Ready for this shit? You want me to freeze him? Freeze right, him? No, no, no. Just... Okay, dude. Go out, chill. Alright. Oh my god. <laughs> Pray, dude, don't. <laughs> Are you dead too? Never, oh no, you're alive, you're alive. You never stood <laughs> a like, chance. Damn, savage. Sheesh, that thing is sick. Classic shield kill. Classic shield kill. Never had a I win. Was really had a jet Never pack. had a win. I have I have beaten the original Spelunky. The, the Spelunky was Spelunky one was actually the first thing ever on my channel. If you go to the if you go to the beginning of my YouTube channel, you can see my original Spelunky one YouTube only non streamed. Oh, dude! I, yeah, I popped through with the, the shotgun <laughs> bullet all the way over here. All right, porcupine, you piece of shit! Come here. You're not alone. You're not dead. Hit him with the skull. Damn, missed. Wait, did I? No, I didn't hit him. I didn't hit him! Fuck this. Ah! Nice. Uh, here, you grab, grab that stuff. Uh, there is going to be angry shopkeepers at the end, so you have to be aware of that. Gotcha. Um... Let's go to the Volcano World. Volcano World's a lot easier. I can't believe we got through the jungle. Is that our first time getting there? Yeah. Is it the second time? I don't remember. Uh, yeah, first. Uh, I think it was the first. Oh, I like that. That's my maybe second favorite so noise. sound in the game. Alright, hold. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> that was close. Let, let me go ahead. I'll just blast uh, some stuff out of the way. Also, there should be... Shopkeeper down here. Let me uh, let me just get in range. Yeah. And just blast him. Got him. Okay. Yeah. Let's go. Where's the shotgun? Oh. Wait. I dropped the block on him. I guess. <laughs> <laughs> Can okay, I blow it up? Can one? I blow it up? Uh. If I blow it up, then the uh, block. Will be no, 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 no. Crush Maybe it, it gets it, rid of it the crush item. It. Yeah. Yeah, it, it crunch. Uh. It gives it the crunch. It's okay. Uh, oh, run! I'm Holy sorry. Shit. I shouldn't have done that. 
Uh, <laughs> forgot that that's how that would happen. Uh, there will be shopkeepers at the end of every level, so we'll, yeah. we'll get you one. Okay, so Ooh. these ball things, if you go under them, they'll, they'll shoot down. So just mm. be very aware. Go past. And then just whenever you buy lava... <laughs> <laughs> jump in it, right? Yeah, just jump in it. Ah! Uh, Do I not? Do those guys not give you turkeys? I guess they aren't turkeys. I guess that would make sense. Definitely bringing this key. It's not here. That guy looks scary. It's Van Horsing. Thank you for the diamond. Oh. Did we get the Ujad Eye? We did not. We might have enough bombs to just bomb down though. We'll, we'll try and get to Vlad's castle because it's the cool. It's one of the coolest things in the whole shop. Uh, I'm gonna need a freeze on that dude, yeah. really bad. I can't reach him. Um, how about now? Oh, okay. Oops. So make sure you don't shoot the robots with the. Uh... Yeah, it bounces off them. It, it does indeed, dude. Can you cook that turkey for me? Thank you, thank you. <laughs> They do cook a fine turkey though, man. I tell you what. Alright. Uh, let's go! Let's I'm doing a lot here. here, guys. I'm doing a lot here. So we should there should be this crazy drill in one of these levels, and then when that's the case, I'm gonna use all the rest of my bombs to bomb down. And get us to Vlad's castle, because it's like the cool it's like probably the coolest probably the coolest area in all of Splunky too, in my opinion. I definitely want to, want to make sure that we get there at some point during this run. I mean, this all looks cool to me. I never I never uh. seen any of this before. Dude, did you see? Did you see? Um, where to save yourself? Oh, I forgot that we had this guy over here. And okay, maybe if I just. <laughs> Depending on the spread, I should be able to hit. Uh, can you freeze him? Bye. Did you see? Oh, do your coffin's oh. right there. Um, uh, yeah, yeah, you should be able to. Uh, uh, I'm so close. Fly up, fly up. Right oh no! All right, wait, wait, wait. Uh, yep. I got it. Let's go. Let's go. Go. Um, and then oh, I don't really want to use a bomb. Here, we'll just we'll just go without the shotgun. Yeah, you can just go. Yeah. Okay, so there there should be the drill here. Okay, so we just have to get to the bottom of the level and then. Show you this cra craziness. You didn't get the Ujot Eye, right? I don't think so. Pretty sure we did not this time. So normally what would happen is that that drill would go down and then you follow that drill all the way to the bottom. And that's how you, oh Jesus Christ. No. I'm still alive, okay. Um. <sighs> How am I supposed to get down? Okay. Uh, you can. Yeah, I would. I would just nope. keep trying to keep trying to get down best that you can. I'm trying. All right, and then we'll. Oh, uh, shotgun. Does that explode? Yes. Okay. It does. Almost there. Actually, I haven't used that many bombs at all. This is kind of like sequence breaking. Uh, for, for what we're supposed to do. You're a cheater. Sure. He's speed running. Uh, yeah, Robotic Rob Robin, thank you. It's, uh, it's, it's very cool. Um, I appreciate that. Uh, just watch out for this thing. Yeah. And let's, let's pop over here. Uh, I cannot. What do you mean? I can't uh, do you need, a, do you need a, uh, a rope? Got you. Yo. Okay. Uh, so this is the kind of like, yeah, grab the, grab the uh, clover. Very important, actually. Otherwise, it would have ran out of time the ghost would come. Just make sure you don't shoot your shotgun. Uh, I would actually get down because I'm, I'm going to need to shoot it. Otherwise, this thing's going to kill me. There's going to be a bunch of spikes at the top. 
Are you ready for the best chord in the game? Uh, there's a dang. Sorry, I had to. <laughs> I was right. really close and I had to. Okay. Um. Oh, what okay. are those? Uh, here, don't, don't go up, don't go up, don't go up, don't go up, go down. Oh, Jesus Christ. <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I didn't even see that. <laughs> uh, okay, let me get this vampire so it should just stay on there. Oh! Oh! Oh, my God. Are hey, you still alive? You're still alive, Ron! Oh. oh, my gosh. Uh, pick up that jetpack. It's so correct. Hell yeah. Okay. Uh, now you're going to have to get. Are you in one of these coffins? Uh, wait, actually, yeah, 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 sh uh, pop one of the coffins. No, I'm not. Never mind. Oh, shit. Uh, that's fine. He's not an enemy. He's not an enemy. Okay, just oh, run. Okay. Just climb, 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 okay. climb. Okay. He's actually uh. a good guy. He'll, he'll fight for you, but he might kill you as well. Okay. Uh, go to the left. Yeah, climb, climb, climb. Uh, and then, oh, oh, God, that arrow trap has yep. already popped. Otherwise, you were about to die. Uh, just walk over to the right. Uh, he should get killed. Yeah. I saved that guy earlier. Uh, shoot him again, shoot him again, shoot him again. Yeah. The red cape's also kind of cracked, but you can probably just take the ground. Uh, but uh, that dude that, that dude with the bow and arrow, he killed him for us because I saved him. I will go back the same way that you came. Because uh, we already did, did all the traps and everything like that. Vlad's Cape, the most poggy side of the game. Yeah, Vlad's Cape is pretty sick. We don't have the Kapala or anything, though. Run all so. the way back? Yeah, we'll just run all the way down. I mean, we'll just kind of move, move, move forward. Yeah, this is a really, really cool little, like, side area. And it's kind of like an oh, homage to, to Hell, which was the um, the hard... Oh, hey. Man. Oh, oh my, God. my gosh, dude. Uh, uh. <laughs> <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. <laughs> Not going to check in my surroundings. You spy uh. using the drill, so you bomb down a lot. Yeah, this, the drill can get very scary. I would just kill that guy, by the way. Just kill Baldy. Hey, it would have been cool. really nice. We could have had Jetpack and Vlad's cape if I, if I hadn't died. It's uh, all your fault, Binks. It Come is, on. man. I think it took a fat L. The thickest of L's. Oh, God. <laughs> Fire away. So close, so close. You told me to fire. <laughs> I did tell and you. Now we're I did on give fire. You, I did give you the. I did give you the fire away. Uh, the fire away uh, uh, call. That's true, man. Oh <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. That was a new PB, maybe? I don't know. Uh, no, the, the, the other one was definitely PB. Totally. But on that side, on the uh, vol volcano side, it was a PB. Ooh. Plus, we got to we see... Well, we've seen both special areas, which is actually really mm. cool. Because like, those are like kind of like, quote-unquote, like, secret secret areas. They have to, like, figure out how to how to do... You were so close to triggering that trap both times. A little times. bit. Oh! <laughs> nice, though. I don't think... Did either of us take a hit? Nope. Oh, Let's both go. of five Let's health. Oh, we got turkey. We got turkey boys. Turkey boys. Ah. Damn. <laughs> <laughs> it's falling from the fucking from the top ropes. Oh, there's a shop up there. Yeah, that's all expensive stuff. We can't. We can, like. Uh, oh, we have to get that bomb box for yeah. sure, man. Bombs are super OP. Uh, I'll go grab the bomb box. Hey -oh. Hey -oh. Yeah, having having a lot of bombs is very very important in this game. I mean, you saw like you know you can you can just kind of bypass stuff, right? Mm. Just being able to like just tell like part of a level like nah, nah I'm good. Uh, if you ah. want if you want this turk here, let me let me set this turkey up for you. Right. 
Oh, wait. Actually, you can just do the trick right here. Thank you. Yeah, it's like tame them before they, they get nice. Uh, and then we'll just hit this guy. Ah, okay. Well, I guess that already fired. Guessing that already fired too. Yeah, I took I took the hit from. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> uh, two people like Spelunky gods and co-op can be easier. I think co-op's always easier, personally. Uh, just because you get you get, like in, in regular Spelunky, you die, you die. In this, you die, you get back, you die, you come back, you die, you come back. Maybe it's like sometimes kind of hard to like finish out. And the ghost is OP. All right. Uh, so I'll go bring your turkey to the end. And I, I can take care of bring this guy to the end. Can you grab that? Uh, yeah. Uh, if you if you hold up and jump, uh, you can Mario like Yoshi. You know, Mo oh, Yoshi yeah, yeah. will like Mario, or you can Mario jump the Yoshi and just yeah, like eat you. him. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Uh, is I there going up here that we need? Let me just check up here. Yeah. yeah, yeah. Look at a turkey, boys. Let's go, turkey boys. <laughs> You don't think you'd have as much fun playing single player? I think single player is unbelievable. I think single player is probably more rewarding, uh, in my opinion. Um, yeah, I'll just uh, eat a rope. Get out of the way. And then we throw an arrow down there. Nice. I think that like winning Spelunky in single player is it's such a rewarding experience because it just takes so many times. You die so often. Is he dead? Or turkey? Oops. <laughs> <laughs> don't, don't love to hear that sound. <laughs> oh, we're good. Oops. We're good. I tried to blow up a turkey, but I, I missed. Um, okay, we got a key. key. Oh, where the exit is. Though. A key, a key. What does a key mean? Is that me here? Uh, I think it means help. I don't know. Uh. Key, a key. Oh no! Uh... Remember me? <laughs> Just kidding. Oh, you're like, nice. Yeah, it's like the only way you can survive those if you have like a caper, something like that. Uh... <laughs> what, what were you thinking? Uh, <laughs> I was trying to just pick up the key. <laughs> and, yeah, the only uh, way you survive is with like a cape or something. Yeah. Okay, fuck it. <laughs> Caves I'm are superhuman. I wanted to test your theory. <laughs> yeah, that, that, that level was psycho. You were very true. <laughs> that, that, that level was uh, terrifying. There's just some levels in this game where it's just like, why, like, why is this, why is this allowed? Why are you allowed to make this the level? Mm. Frozen. Mm. <laughs> That's unfortunate. <laughs> I, I didn't him. feel like actually <laughs> holding it down that long. <laughs> so I just I simply didn't feel I was like trying it. to <laughs> I was trying to You're just right, push him into the I didn't feel like it. So. <laughs> you piece of shit. Come here. You key, bitch. I'm just gonna key this guy to death. Piece of garbage. Oh, Son no. Son of a bitch! All right, fi finish what we started. Key him. Yeah! <laughs> All right, I got it. Come on, give him the key. Give him the key. Ah! Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can't get... No. <laughs> Nightmare. Oh. oh, you got it. You got it. You can make that jump, I believe. And let me give you a little boost. Push me. Ah. <sighs> Oh, let's go. All right, All right. Keys, bitch ass. Damn. Oh, <laughs> hey, we got him. We got a hit. We got a hit. <sighs> oh, you just. <laughs> <laughs> 
Fuck me. <laughs> he jumped so high. Ah. What a cheater, dude. All right, I'm down for one more run. Ah, uh, dude, that sounds good for me, man. Last one, best one, baby. Uh, yeah, let's actually try this time. Uh, have you not been trying? <laughs> uh, oh my. All right, that one is a count. That one is a count. That one is a count. All right, that's the stream, guys. <laughs> <laughs> All right, one more, one more. Watching it from the oh Z Z just called you out, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Watching it from this stream is better. <laughs> all right, all right, we got this, dude. Just watch out for that spike trap. Don't just jump right over. I it. almost I almost jumped into it. <laughs> <laughs> spike traps get you, man. I swear I'm good at most games. This game is like a big exception. It just takes a while, dude. It just takes a lot of knowledge and a lot yeah. of uh, reps. Uh, do you need anything or can I just finish the level? Uh, I'm good. What's up, Z? Good luck on your tournament on Saturday. What are you? What uh? What deck are you bringing? <laughs> I'll try not to. <laughs> <laughs> He's just beating the shit out of me, dude. What the hell? Oh, it takes two damage. I always forget that. Lots of hidden tech. Very true. Ooh, dude, we're gonna sacrifice the doggo. A free item. Nice. But at what cost? Ooh. What did it cost? <laughs> Everything. <laughs> Everything. It's okay. Dogs have nine lives or something like that. Yeah, yeah. Sure. Yes. <laughs> what do you think? You want shoes or, or bombs? Why do you choose? Uh, what about the boomerang? No. Uh, no, boomerang you get for like free later. It's Let's not really get good some in the first shoes. I feel like the boomerang's really good in the uh, in the jungle level where you could get it, but outside of that, it's kind of kind of mid. Kind of feels mid. All right, look out for the fucking mole. It's coming. No! <laughs> it is both, son of a bitch. Oh, nice. Super easy. Uh, super easy key. It's shit. All right, go uh, go grab the uh, the chest. I'll take care of the stupid mole. Monk. Aha! Did you make sure to do the sound for yep. the chat? Of course, come on. Very important. You got three in mind, yo. This card, good cards, Valk. Yeah, those, those, those all seem good. This card is Swarm female. How does this card work? That one's interesting. Oh, is it like a Hella? Hella? I think so. That's kind of cool. Hella with like weird big cards, like Spider Woman, like Arrow, stuff like that. I kind of dig it. Death? Yeah, you can do death. Oh. Uh, I think we just move on. None of these are that good. Eh, gotta waste the rope though. Oh, dude, we get the Kabbalah! So huge. I'm taking it though, for sure. <laughs> I can't trust you with it. <laughs> I almost killed myself in my life. This is the Kapala. Oh, okay, it's a little cup. It's a cup, and basically now every time I kill things, I soak up the blood, and when it overfills, um, I get one point of health. Damn. Kind of, it's like the probably the strongest in the game. Yeah, with Hala. Yeah, that's that's a cool idea. I think that I think that deck goes, that deck sounds pretty nasty. I think a lot of people will bring good card stuff. You might you yeah. definitely want to bring She Hulk too to just counter the She Hulk wave decks and stuff. I really love, um, me and Cam Best did, did an event where we, uh, yeah, Demon was there too. Uh, yeah, we, I think we, I heard had, about that. We had eight cards banned. And it was just like, it was so cool to just play like all these decks that are like not really on meta and like ha have to like think about not worrying about certain cards. Dude freaking brought Snow Guard. <laughs> <laughs> and I got an epic clip with it. The snow guard play was was out of control. Dude. <laughs> Me and we were losing our minds. It was worth it. I got this. Uh, we just gotta do. We just gotta go a little bit of trigonometry here. Wow, that was perfect. Nailed Almost. It. Kinda. Yeah. Um. Yeah, we don't really have the bombs to kill this turkey. Let's just move on. Let's go. Enjoy the restrictions, yeah. It's it's just it's a little bit different, you know. It's a little, little spice of life. Yeah. Oh 
Oh my god, correct. <laughs> these lizards, dude, they're so mean. I'm pillowing, pillowing. Got pillowed. I mean, uh, you. Bum ass bat. Oh, we don't even have a key to kill this guy now. What are we gonna do? I can freeze him. I got him. Nice. Um, I do kind of want to. It cost me two bombs to get to. Yeah, let's go Volcano World again. We have the. Uh... Wait, I have to make sure I get your bag. Where'd you die? Uh, yeah, right there. Nice. Yeah, I almost left your bag and then we wouldn't have had the eye. So we can do the drill this time. Hopefully, if we make it that far. The drill's really cool. It is kind of scary. Uh, some people don't even do the drill. Uh, I almost died. Uh, can, oh, can you blow that rock off and trigger the trap? Look at that, dude. Look Teamwork. at that assist, baby. Where to watch the games with the band format? Um, so, me and D Money did an event. Um, if you look up Snap Battles on YouTube, Snap Battles, it's a pretty small YouTube channel. Uh, but there's one there's a whole event it's a three and a three and a half hour one if you're talking about the one that's uh, Z underscore three in chat uh, also really cool or Z three underscore also a very very good Marvel snap streamer um, Is doing uh, it's on Felicity's channel, which is twitch.tv slash Felicity f-e-l-i-c-t-y And that is on Saturday. That's on Saturday at 2 2 pt. I believe pretty sure uh, uh, Something like that I actually have it uh, There's E right there. Look at that. Uh, 2 p.m. ET, so 1 p.m. Uh, 1 p.m. Uh, Central. 2 p.m. ET. On uh, Twitch.tv slash Felicity. All female characters, uh, so no no male characters. Uh, only Series 3 and below to make sure that everyone is it's approachable to everyone. Um, really, really cool. Yeah, nice. I'm going to be doing... I'm going to be... Thank you. I'm gonna be watching uh, the tournament during my my subathon that I'm doing on Oh, you're coaching me. Oh, pong. Yeah. Oh, jeez. Forgot if you hang on till you fall. Uh. Oh, don't grab that. Jesus Christ. I'm not. I'm not. I'm not. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> you scared the hell out of me. Okay, this is a bit spooky. <laughs> if you grab that, then all those things explode and all the lava would come down on us. Mm. Uh. I think we just hot drop. Trying. Nice. Wanna hit that guy? Uh, it's actually nice that this didn't tip over. The lava's very annoying to deal with, actually. Okay, oh, come on, oh, give oh. us the drill. Give us the drill. The drill's a really cool thing, too. It'd be, it'd be cool to show people who maybe don't know Splunky that well uh, the drill. Uh, how am I supposed to get across here? Uh, oh, you might not be able to actually. You might just <laughs> kind of have to vibe if, if I'm being real with you. I forgot that there's stuff like that in uh, this thing. I'll just speedrun. I'll just speedrun strats. <laughs> yeah, you got this. Uh. Yeah, if you're not doing anything on Friday, by the way, I was going to DM you about it. I still could, but um, <laughs> Friday, I'll put you on the spot right now. What's that? Um, so I'm starting my sub on Thursday, and mm -hmm. then I have a goal, uh, if we reach it, which we probably should, uh, that, uh, I'll be playing Pictionary, like a script, like scribble.io, with, uh, with a bunch of, uh, snap creators. Ready to see and... this? Oh, shit. I'll continue after this. Oh, my God. That'll just drill all the way down to where we were last time. Uh, what, do you know what time it is on Friday? Or do you have a, do you have a time? Uh, set? it would be at 4 p.m. EST. 4 p.m. EST. That shouldn't be an issue. Uh, just, yeah. uh, just, just, just hit me up about it. I'll show um, you up. Yeah, show you a DM. Okay, so that's the regular exit, but we want the the sick exit. Okay, I'm gonna send this guy down. Um, I already have shoes. Do you want to grab these spring shoes? I'll grab the gloves. And then since I have the gloves, you want to grab these ropes. Oh, never mind. I don't have enough money. Okay. Uh, and then we just take this down, and then we do the same thing with the castle. So instead of bombing all the way down, we uh, we just get to follow this. This dang drill. No! No, make it in, Hammy! Oh. 
Oh, he made it. He made it. I oh, think. yeah? I think he made <laughs> so it. So close. Yeah. <laughs> he must have. He must have. I mean, okay. Uh, nice. Can we get a turkey? Free turkey? I love being a turkey boy. The buzz drill. Yeah, slice through the altar, slice through a shop. Uh, oh, I can't pick the turkey. We're back. Back. This is going to be scary because. Oh, well, maybe it's less scary that we don't have a shotgun this time. <laughs> Could very make it make it significantly less scary. Oh, uh, they do the cord it hits. Uh... <laughs> uh, we also don't have the guys, so if we want the cape, we have to, we're gonna have to kill. The oh Jesus Christ! These vampires are so scary. Uh, that is fucked. <laughs> I got him! I got him! <laughs> that wrecked. Um. We got this, we got this. I don't even know how to kill this guy actually without uh, having that dude do it. Alright, I need you I need your I need your help, sir. Already triggered. Okay. Sorry, I need your help. Oh don't don't why are you unleashing all these guys? Why'd you let him why, Oh <laughs> Why'd you I'll let just, him out? <laughs> I'll just see it if if uh if I was secretly in one this time. <laughs> they're gonna hit like a <laughs> thing, they're gonna kill me. You were secretly in, oh, in one this time. <laughs> They're doing work. They're doing work. Let's see, any more vampires? Ah! Oh! Several more vampires. You got, you got a lot of life. You got a lot of life. Nice, nice, nice. Vampire's still alive? Freeze his ass. Yeah. Wait, maybe you can freeze uh, Vlad. Maybe it'll be actually really easy. Yeah, if you freeze him, he just dies, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Uh, we only have two minutes left, so we gotta we gotta keep things moving. Might only be a minute, uh, an hour thirty-two actually. Uh, so this guy's gonna come out. I need you to freeze that dude. who's right above the crown. Oh, okay, sick. Correct. So this thing has a double jump, and it gets extra, extra. Um... Oh. Oof. Easy peasy and co-op. Yeah, Mine very true. <laughs> My super <laughs> You're not in one of those, dude. Stop trying to make it happen. Where am I? All right, we got you. We got you. Am I just in a fake corner? What is this? Oh. Is this is this an exit? It's not an exit. Oh no! Wait, we're in trouble. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. It's okay. I got extra time now. We do have extra time. I think it's. I have to go left and then up. Left and then down. There we go. Okay. Okay. Have an actually sick run. Yeah. The Kapal is the Kapal is huge. Kapal is huge. We have the turkey. Oh, that's pretty huge too. Just just wait until one of these uh, lava things just kills me. All right. We got this, dude. We got this. All right. Let's find. This let's is find. It. Let's find our boy. Oh my god, dude, Ooh. there's so much stuff happening. Oh. Oh, it's a lava monster! <laughs> uh, what is he called? Lava Mander, I think is his name? He's very scary. Nice. Wasn't scared for a second. Nice, good assist. Assist. Doing what I can. Yo, oh, let's, let's go! Let's go! Right, just watch out for those boulders. Not a nice boulder like Shrek. Fuck me! <laughs> uh. <laughs> Alright, we're back to the Olmec. Unfortunately, I do have to, uh... Uh, yeah. Unfortunately, I do have to kill him by myself again. Oh god, I almost just died there. You got this, you got this. We'll just do the same thing. Or do you want to see Temple? Do you want to see the, the last level? I can, try and, I can try and get us to there. The Legend of the there, Forbidden actually. Temple? Sure, yeah. No. Let's uh let's go to Temple. Temple's it's very hard, but um it's cool. It's interesting. I'll just like bomb us down, I think. If if I'm being keeping it real with you. Ah! Oh god! 
Oh my god. <laughs> oh. Clean. Oh my god. He's fine, he's fine. Okay, very nice, very nice. Alright, so now we're in Temple. This is the... This is only two more worlds for us to see after this one. Kind of banger music too. I never go to Temple. It's so, so annoying. This was the... This is like the final, final level of the main Splunky. Or the first Splunky. That dude will poison you. Be a nightmare. Oh! That's me! Yep, that's you. Oh, I got you. Okay. Uh, we don't really want to fuck with this die. guy. Oh! Dude, you gotta watch it. <laughs> if you if you hang off a ledge yeah, like that, you'll drop it. Okay. We don't really want to fuck with this guy. His name's Anubis. He will murder us. I think we have to like activate him in this one. Oh! He's blinking. Oh, okay. All right. We just oh, gotta go. We just gotta activated. go. These these things will kill us. Things will one shot us. Oops. <laughs> <laughs> I was trying to kill a snake. <laughs> oh, dude. Dude, right, that two hours flew by, man. <laughs> Oh, fuck. Holy, that two hours flew <laughs> by. Yeah, well, Demonic game, Dude, fun as always. Uh, yeah. sh hit me up about uh, Friday. I, I can't commit just yet because I have to yeah, talk yeah, to my yeah, girlfriend and make sure we don't have sure. anything on the docket. But she should be at work. Actually, uh, wh what time, ET? Uh, 4 p.m. 4 p.m. Eastern time. Yeah, no, uh, lock me in 100%. Let's go. Awesome. All right, yeah. I got like, I think it's like five or six of us and... Uh, just gonna be playing for like a half hour to an hour. Just uh, drawing Marvel Snap characters, guessing what they are. Yeah. Love it, dude. <clears throat> All right. Uh, well, yeah, thanks for playing again. Let's go with me, another installment. Uh, yep. If you're, if you're interested, I will put D Money's uh, stuff in the chat. D Money, awesome Marvel Snap streamer, also does some cool variety stuff. I'll then throw all his info if you want to follow him in the chat. Um, yeah, but yeah, check dude. out Binks. Oh, he streams on Twitter, on Twitch, streams and on Twitch. YouTube. Check him out. He's got hella content. Awesome dude. New, new Twitter, new Twitter just dropped. Yeah, new I, new Twitter streamer. I just wasn't dropped. supposed to leak that. I wasn't supposed to leak that. <laughs> dude, my boy Elon, my boy Elon paid paid the bills. <laughs> I wouldn't doubt it. Um, well, dude, uh, yeah. good luck on your subathon, man. Uh, seems really exciting. Thank you, man. Yeah, this is my second uh, uncapped subathon. Uh, la the last one I had to shave my eyebrows on stream. So, what the fuck? Uh, dude? I do some crazy stuff for money. Yeah, I'll do almost anything for money. Hey man, won't, don't we all? <laughs> well, I will uh, catch. I will catch yep. you later, my man. Uh, enjoy your subathon, and I will. Uh, I'll see you on Friday. Have a good night. It was nice you playing too. with you. Peace out. Peace. Well, chat, that was a ton of fun. Uh, uh, dude, I, we're going to keep doing this. I, I want to just keep doing this forever, man. I really like having at least one night a week where we, we like guarantee that we're going to do some variety and get a, a shoot the shit with someone else. Thanks for owning sticks around. Uh, down to 335 across both, but that's uh, incredibly awesome. Uh, actually insane uh, to, to have this many people just hang out and watch me super late at night play cool video games uh, that I just like to play. Let's uh, see if... Somebody's still on this call. But, yeah, no. Hey, you ending stream? Uh, oh, shit, you're in there. <laughs> I, saw, I just jumped back. I just jumped back in. Are you ending stream? Oh, uh, yeah, I'm ending stream right now. Okay, cool, cool, cool. All right, peace. All right, peace. I just want to see if I wanted to raid him or not. Yeah, no, let's send over Smooth Out, dude. Smooth Out is uh, super cool. Oh, no, Smooth Out ended. Let's see who else is playing Marvel Snap. Uh, we have Spyro. We did we did raid him very recently. I usually like to uh, spin around. Princess Tofu. How are you? Oh my god, I never had this. All right, you're watching. You're hearing me get killed in the background. What do I want to do here? Hmm. All right, cool. Uh, liking the vibe. Uh, we'll send you over to Brian on the Rocks. I don't know anything about him, but he has Stegron, so that's pretty exciting. Uh, we'll go ahead and send him over. Oh, thank you so much, uh, Rainy. 
incredibly, incredibly kind of all y'all. Uh, we'll send y'all over. Thank, thank you very much as well. Uh, you got incredibly nice. Much variety streamers with so much. This is good when you play Snap, uh, a game I love. Oh man. Uh, I am tired. I do have to edit a video, which will suck, but we will knock it out. Thank you all so much for being here. Have fun. Tell Brian of the Rocks I said what's up. Uh, I'm not going to be there, but you all have a good rest of your night. Peace. Watching on YouTube. There's Brian's on the Rocks. Steph. <laughs>